Oh god. Wait. Hello everyone. One second. Let's see. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So, I have a bit of a resizing issue. <laughs> I have a bit of a resizing issue because of, uh... Well, first of all, my fucking... Okay. First of all... Okay, I have a resizing issue because... I, like, scaled my entire stream down from 4040p to 1080. Uh... <laughs> and I haven't used this intermission for a long time. Oh my god. Fit the screen. Oh my god, here's me. No? That's not me? Where the fuck's my webcam? Source. There it is. Oh my god. I think my entire green screen might be... Oh yeah, I had to uh, put it back in place properly because I've been cleaning my <laughs> my room today. <laughs> One second. Uh... Here we go. Here we go. Oh yeah, I think that might just be an intermission thing. Wait, is it the same here? No, I just had to crop it out a bit more. There we go. Uh, so, I'm just waiting for Trepang 2 to download. Uh, it's almost done downloading. It literally just came out, so... Um, they didn't have a preload or anything. Uh, but the... <coughs> the idea is... To... Stream tr Trepang 2, and I don't know how long Trepang is, um, but if it if like the stream ends too soon or something, or like if the game ends too soon, I mean, uh, I'll probably check out Halls of Torment, which is this new uh, Vampire Survivor looking game that's been getting like a lots of praise. So we might do a Trepang 2 and Halls of Torment stream today, if not only just a Trepang 2 stream, but uh, it's almost done downloading. And then we can, uh, get going right away. But, uh, hello, Ivan. What's up? Hello, Lurkers. Hello, everyone. I would put this in the Trepan category on Kick if they had one. But they don't, so I just have it in, uh, games and demos right now. Uh, I guess the game is just... Just too new. Too new for Kick. It's a little indie shooter, so it doesn't surprise me, really. Baba Booey. Welcome, Nick. Welcome. But yeah, as soon as the game is done downloading, it's at 94%. We'll just uh, get going and uh, see what Trepang's all about. I heard this game's like fear. Yeah, Trepang is like fear. And it's it's not Trepang 2. It's more like Trepang cubed. Like, it, 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 it has like the two raised up. I don't know what it means, what it means for the story's sake. I didn't even play the demo. I just heard that the demo was pretty good. And I decided to wait for a full version. This is not a sequel, it's the first game in the series, or like the first game this developer has made even, or developer team. So I don't know why it's called Trepan 2, will the game answer that? I don't know, that would be like the one goal to find out today, won't it? But uh, yeah, I heard it's a lot like Fear, um, you know, it's got high octane, action, slow-mo reflexes. Um, Trepang squared, yeah, I guess. Um, and it might have some spooky elements to it as well. I have no idea. Like, I haven't played the demo. We're, we're just gonna hop into uh, this game blind. Uh, I've only seen a few trailers of it and it looked uh, it looked dope. So, uh, yeah, launching the game now. Main system, engaging combat mode. Uh, let's see here. Game is launching. It's probably gonna be fucking loud at the start. I apologize if it is. Warning, this Okay, that's spooky. Why did it do that? Trepan 2, keep subject restrained at all times. Danger. A wheelchair, cool. Oh, sheets? There's a full sheet menu? 
Okay, this main menu is actually kind of spooky. What's the sheets menu? Oh, yeah, like this is how you fucking unlock all of them. Complete missions, redacted. Minimum on hard, minimum on extreme for insane gore. Whoa, squeaky voices, T posing, NPC thrusters. What? No slide damage, draining health, infinite cloak, fika. What? Team team on sandbox. Spooky mode, no checkpoints, knife bullets. Okay. Weird. There's a full sheet mode and like how you unlock stuff. That's kind of cool. Um, difficulty. Easy, normal, hard, very hard, extreme rage mode. I guess we'll do very hard. Why not? I'm a gamer. If it's very, if very hard is too fucking hard, then we'll uh, go down to no to like hard, I guess. But. Man, the fucking screaming and the shattering in the background, that's kinda cool. English, of course. Low violence mode off, of course. We're we're gonna do high violence. FOV. Put it up to uh 105. Uh I've had a motion blur. FPS limit. Ew. Put it up to like 165, that should be good. No V sync, we're now pleb. Unlock insane settings. Expect severe for performance drops when playing with these settings. Okay, we're not gonna do insane settings then. I just wanna play the game. View distance, epic. Oh, it has DLSS support. You know, let's let's just do a uh, epic quality preset. What does that look like? I mean, that's that looks good. Carnage, epic. How many bodies, bullet holes, and body parts and blood stains can stay in the world? Very CPU intense with higher settings. Rage mode, interesting name. Yeah, that, we might have to do that later. Who knows? Prop detail. Yo, this is a good options menu because you can see like exactly what it affects and stuff. Effects, textures, shadows, foliage. Yeah, DLSS, anti-aliasing, anti-aliasing method. Yeah, TAA, post-processing. U distance. I just wonder what insane settings are. So like if we target okay, then we just get insane on top of epic. Okay. Well let's not do that. Let's not do that right now. I'll have to experiment with that later. Hold crouch, no. Hey, what's up, empathetic? Welcome. Uh sprint, fire, flashlight on T, sure. I mean Toggle zoom, I don't need that. Let's just put the and on the grenade already bound to zoom god damn it okay so how do i unbind it oh no uh, 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 uh this button no oh man it, it's like i had to bind into something else to be able to let's just put it on uh. oh my what no fuck you it's not bound to that button anymore how about applying it it's a bit of a janky uh, key binding uh, system here. But, oh well. Let's see. Jump, slide on left alt. Uh, let's do mouse four for that. Focus on Q, cloak on E, interact on F. What's up, Skull Pyro? Welcome. Melee on mouse two. Interesting. Wait. Oh. Maybe we should do zoom toggle on mouse free. No, what am I saying? We're gonna put melee on mouse 5. Jesus. And we're just gonna do... <sighs> I hate that you have to apply it to... Hey, what's up, Gepa? Dual wield? Hell yeah. Okay, so our, our, our binding should be good. I have no idea. I'm gonna put this on 8 because it's an epic game, but we'll see how bad this sensitivity is. Oh, you can show and show HUD and stuff. Alright. I think we're ready to go very hard. Start new game. Oh, easy. Have some ca casual fun. We won't judge. Normal. Recommended difficulty for players who occasionally play FPS games. Hard. Recommended for experienced FPS players looking for a challenge. Very hard. Punishingly difficult. You will die. A lot. 
extreme, ridiculously difficult. Expert master of the game's mechanics and exploits are required to play on this difficulty. Rage mode. Enemies have eyes on the back of their heads. Instant reaction times and near perfect accuracy. Only some kind of sick and twisted person can enjoy this. Okay. We'll do very hard. That sounds good to me. Oh shit, lore. Oh, this is just a loading screen. It doesn't actually go anywhere. Yo, we're jumping right into the spookiness. I don't like red doors. You're not a sick and twisted person. I mean, I am, but... That's a good jump scare. Oh, Wobble. Oh, I guess we were getting like indoctrinated or something by the TV. All right, mysterious intro. Oh God. First of all, yeah, these settings didn't save. Oh god, why is it so loud? Oh, none of the fucking settings I did saved, damn it. That's annoying. Wait, let me guess, that didn't save again. No, it did. That's some very loud mu uh, menu music. Oh god, the motion bear. <laughs> Fuck. Wait, motion blur was here, right? No. There it is. Okay, there we go. Much cleaner. Jesus. Wait, 120? Huh. Oh yeah, V-Sync. Off with that shit. There we go. There we go. Now we're utilizing all of my frame rate. Keep such. Oh, yeah, this is literally just the intro menu. Yo, I can see my fucking ghost teabag. Gold security, this is Echo 3. What's your status, over? Uh oh. I don't think they can answer. They're having a snappy time. Oh, don't do that. All units were under attack by unknown elements. Execute Operation Bright Star immediately. Bright Star. I don't like having handcuffs on. Oh shit. Control of all securities KIA. Uh oh. Is that me? Am I one of those tier six? Shadow stuff. The dot appears in the center screen when you are in shadow. Enemies will take longer to spot you. Oh, okay, so it's kind of like Thief, I guess. Except not really. Yeah, you stick to the shadows and you should be fine, right? I like their uh, design, they look cool.
so far we're doing it. I'm actually like succeeding at stealthing here. It's actually kind of cool how they're like scared of you, even though you only have handcuffs, but they don't know that, do they? Oh god. Oh god. Oh, medkit. Oh shit. Okay, E E is stealth apparently. Hope. Oh, I can't see shit, lads. Okay. CCTV systems. Yo, this is like if they dropped you into Half Life, like in the middle of uh, the fucking Hiku invading, you know? But you also have no guns. Um. Oh! Guns! Oh, hell yeah. Yo, is that a fucking USP, my beloved? Oh! Wait, unlock restraints? I already did that. Oh. Yo, that fucking pistol looks meaty as hell. Oh, you can't iron sight with it? Yeah, my, the rest of my keybinds work, so I guess you can't just iron sight with the pistol. That's okay. We don't need iron sights anyway. Oh. That was loud. Jesus Christ, the gunshot makes my fucking audio levels peek out the ass. Let's try that again. Bro, it still peaks my fucking audio levels. Wait, let me uh, reduce the volume on uh, Wavelink. Yeah, that should be better for you guys. Nice weapon animations. I mean, yeah, guns should be loud, but, you know, I don't want my fucking, like, this shit to peak your your eardrums, you know? It's like the beginning of Half-Life 2 Episode 1. Yeah, it kinda. I heard this game someone like Half-Life mixed with fear. That's the impression I get, too. It doesn't help that, you know, we're clad in orange. Wait, I can see my fucking feet! Yo! Game of the year! Also, Poot, I don't want your ears to peek. Melee, jump and melee to do power. Oh my god, it's exactly like fear. Except it doesn't do a full drop kick. Huh. Maintenance. AG Parker Horizon Core. Adam, you're, dra you're you draft dodging Neanderthal. <laughs> you're draft dodging Neanderthal. <laughs> I can tell you're not doing your fucking part. You need to take your ass down to maintenance and fix those goddamn steam pipes. Left and read. Wait, what? Alright, make sure to bring eye protection. You may get his eye gouged out after a valve combusted. Well, that's a hyperbole, but it could happen yet. It's to bring eye protection. You better be down there fixing those fucking pipes. I swear if I find you in the break room. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, what? Serenity, erase your light, take your flight to a place where you will be remembered, to a place where you will be loved. Huh. Alright. Gonna make signals here. I guess we're yump. Enemies can see your flashlight. Well, I guess we're not stealthing them. Oh. Hi, Talon, and bye, Talon, by the way. Oh. oh, I picked up ammo, I guess. 
It's like Doom 3 where the spooky has happened before the spooky even begins. I'm like mildly spooked right now. Oh my god, I pressed the wrong button again. Well, I can't use the um, health kit. I guess I'm not hurt. And yeah, that's slide. Yo, can we slide cancel like we're playing playing fucking Call of Duty? Oh shit. Yo. God damn, son. Holy shit, we can go. Poot, wait, what? Wait for what? Shoot the first aid kit? Good idea. Nope. No hinges? Nah. I'm sure it'll give us a tutorial soon. It's a modern game after all. What's up, Raz? Grab enemy. Oh shit. It's not gonna make a single fucking noise about it. Wait, what's the kill button do? <laughs> Holy shit! Oh! Okay! Dude, that's fucking satisfying. Throw him? Oh, I, I'm gonna do that to the next guy. Yo, level 4 body armor. A 762mm animated ball protection. Yeah, I should have thrown him, man. I was scared. He was looking at me funny. Yeah, that was extremely fucking bloody. Dude, the fucking gore in this game. Like, the gunplay so far. Like, I've only had a pistol, but it, that it, feel, but it feels amazing. Oh, you can slide kick open doors. Good to know. I'm like in my own fucking Michael Bay movie, but with like 50 times the gore. Well, I haven't seen an explosion yet, so how can I be sure? Oh, press E to cloak. Oh shit, oh shit. Okay, we got a vector with lots of ammo. Dude, that cloaking was fun. That's a fun mechanic. Just disappear in the middle of combat. Just fucking grab him. Grab a hostage. Oh, wrong button. Yeah, there we go. What even is this game about? Well, apparently we're a test subject or something and we have just been broken free. From some... Ah, oh, there's a two weapon limit. What the fuck? Wait, one and two doesn't switch weapons? Oh, the scroll... Ugh. Okay, gotta fix that. I mean... <laughs> oh, come to papa! Oh my... Wait. Oh man, wait. So we got the vector, right? 
Oh, that feels pretty good, but I have a better idea. Cannot do a wield serum required. Fuck! Okay. I'm playing on very hard. Slow-mo, yes, like fear, yeah. Well, I can't even touch you. Bad level design. We'll see if this ga game has it. Oh god, wait, my focus bar is slow. Oh, it's out, shit. I was hoping that the extinguisher would uh, pop. I'm very hard, but I difficulty very hard. <laughs> nice cover up. I mean, I am pretty hard right now as well from this video game. But yeah, my focus bar hadn't recovered, so I uh, gotta, gotta keep an eye out for that. Dude. Dude, this game's kick fucking ass, dude. I'll be moving to kick. Twitch sucks. You mean YouTube? Can you grab people with shields? That's a good question. We should try that. Because you can just sneak up behind them and then grab them. Then, like, what what can I do? Kill, sprinting cost stamina. Killing enemies temporarily boost stamina. Okay. Oh, so if you're aggressive, you get to move faster. That's cool. I'm not going to lie, guys. I think I like the pistol more than the vector. Yes, because I feel more badass with the pistol. Even though the vector is, like, objectively better firepower. Don't do that, spooky body. Wait, can you mutilate bodies? Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Now we know. Just asking for a friend. I'm not a psycho or anything. Yeah, let, let's let's take out a few more guys with the vector, and then we'll swap back to the pistol. Cause like I, I felt more badass with the pistol. Oh. Is that Katana? No fucking way, dude. Please grab the Katana. Oh no, he's just gonna leave him there? What the fuck was that coin about? Is this Jan Wick? Guy commits Sudoku, did he commit Seppuku? Literally duality of man. They were trying, but the equipment is all kinds of haywire. Keeps disconnecting on us. Don't bitch at me, you whiny fuck. Just make do with what you got and shut the fuck up. Wow. Oh my god. Dude, whoa. Whoa, from us? Not really. G36, I guess. Or something. That's not a FAMAS. It's a bullpup rifle. That's good enough for me. Hell yeah. Oh. Not, not a lot of ammo for it, though. Dude, you feel so fucking good in this game that it's a FAMAS? Really? It looks so weird. Maybe it, maybe it's a very modern, weird version of it. Certainly doesn't, like, look 
just without the rail. Okay, this gun is already empty. Oh, that's what I say when a pistol is more badass, right? Oh my god. But, can we get more ammo for this gun? Ah, uh, you know what? We'll, we'll stick to pistol and shotgun for now. Find them more fun. But yeah, you can fucking... Uh, if you grab enemies, you can, like, toss them like a grenade. That's cool. You can just turn them into, like, meat shield fucking suicide bombs. Emergency phone. Wait, what? Oh. Poo doesn't know how elevators work, apparently. Which side will open? Oh, this side. This game is cool. Damn, it's fucking cool. Body armor. I mean, I'm max health, max armor all the time, baby. This game is porn. It fucking is. Yo, pick up intel. Bain, brain transplant proposal from K Takiguchi to CEO subject brain transplant proposal Anton I feel like we're hitting a brick wall with the WBE project we are working prototypes on a limited scale in theory we should be able to scale up to digitally emulate a whole human brain but the power and processing requirements are extremely prohibitive we will need at least 1 million CPUs and several nuclear reactors to power just a single unit this may be doable budget-wise, but it's not discreet enough. I propose a much simpler but more effective solution. A whole brain transplant. Not physically, but rewiring the recipient's brain entirely to match the donor, using the same tech that we use for memory transplants. Think of it, it's much easier for us to find brain transplant recipients than to build massive computing facilities. It's discreet, more cost-effective, and we already have most of the technology. Let me know if you'd like to proceed, I can start right away. Regards to Dr. Ken Takaguchi, Site 14 Research Director, PhD Anomalous Sciences. Oh, it's gonna come out for console later this year. Like, they, they announced it today with the PC release that they're working on console. Site 40 message log budgeting. Ha. Huh. Your recent security changes grew into a logistical nightmare. You delegated funding to hiring more security personnel, cameras, ID scanners, laser gates. I told you to queue these things over the course of a couple months, not all at once. You got the entire Eastern Wing backline of much needed scientific funding. And to put it frankly, Site 14 security defenses are fine as it is. As, or as is. We've had zero incidents in the past three years. Undo this nonsense now. The longer this goes on, the larger the blemish this will have on my spotless record. Ah, and let me guess, this is Site 14? Yep. Well, I'm fucking loose, baby. The goose is loose. Sierra 4 mission report. O200, taking our sentry duties from Sierra 3 at checkpoint B13. No pat patrol scheduled today due to snowstorm. O415, unidentified helo spotted about 1 km northwest. O417, lost visual contact with unidentified helo, possibly landed or crashed into forest. O420, Sierra 3 and control notified. Control orders all Sierra units are on alert, but the whole positions until weather subsides. 0451, the weather conditions improved, starting patrol to investigate Hilo's last position. 
0510, visual smoke rising from forest one kilometers northwest from checkpoint, moving to possible crash site. 0536, a ride at crash site, unidentified helicopter wreckage, no signs of survivors, continuing to investigate. 0550, Operation Bright Star initiated, all units were called back to site 14. Yep. I didn't pick it up. Oh, Operation Bright Star. That's a lot of lore all, all of a sudden. Memorandum from Talon Company. Damn, they look badass. Two Chief of Security, Paul McLellan. McLellan. Topic, Operation Bright Star. Talon Company is a black operations unit acting under direct orders from the CEO. In the event the Site-14 is compromised, Talon Company will execute Operation Bright Star immediately. Once the operation has begun, you will have exactly 30 minutes to extract all civilian personnel. Any remaining civilian personnel in the facility will be designated targets by Talon and will be terminated on site. Operation Bright Star is authorized by the board of directors to deny assets from falling into enemy hands. Any interference will be neutralized with extreme prejudice. Creation HS product VHS. Yeah, it's a very weird looking gun. Oh, silence weapons. Shoot out lights, lights to create shadows to kill silently with headshots. Wait, no, wait, they don't have attack in it. Oh my god, they have the attack in this game. What the fuck? Dude, we fucking splinter cell now? I mean, I'm not exactly hidden here, am I? Oh. There's too much light coming from the window. Oh, shit. Ha! <laughs> just fucking tear his head off, man! Oh, if they take the body, so... Uh, yeah. Oh, that reload? Dude, look at that. Oh. Where are you, fucker? Hell yeah. No spirit enemies? I wouldn't discount it yet. Fear also started like a fucking, uh, you know... Action Man game, but then it got spooky and then it became spooky Action Man game. Dude, I enjoy the pistol more than the shotgun just because it's how satisfying it is to play kids in this game. I like this though, but there's too much light. That's one Call of Duty uses for its FAMAS, really? Well, I guess it depends on which Call of Duty, though, right? Security complaint. From Dr. Sean Ratfield, the site forking chief of security, Paul McLellan. Paul, we've had four evacuation drills this week with no notice whatsoever. Do you understand it's hard to get things done with sudden alarms blaring and armed guards ushering us to, free to the freezing cold helipad while we sit and wait for you to count heads for God knows how long? What in the heavens is going on? Why does I need to practice for such an unlikely scenario? Is there something we should be concerned about? Not only is it disrupt disruptive, I have a heart condition, you know. The sudden loud noises and running are hazardous to my health. I would like to opt out of these activities if, possi if possible. Did you get a silencer on that pistol? I looked away for five minutes. Yeah, I picked up a silence pistol. And yeah, you can shoot out lights with it. Oh, when a game auto saves, that's how you know that there's gonna be enemies up ahead.
Silence from us. Oh yeah, that's probably true. Yep, that works. Con online and Black Ops uses the HS product VHS representative from us. Oh, okay. I haven't played Call of Duty online. VHS, sorry. Um, rifle, I'm just gonna call it Rifle. I haven't played Call of Duty online because that was like a like uh, yeah Asia only, and Black Ops One. Well, they're from us. Sucks. Nah, it was OP, but fuck it. Gentlemen, I gather you together to examine a subject with anomalous properties unlike any we've ever seen before. Subject 106. Reportedly, he's able to turn invisible at will, dodge bullets, and possess superhuman strength. Take this with a grain of salt, if you will, as it was reported by not so scientific and minded security personnel who captured him. The subject will be arriving at the loaded bay, loading bay at 1600 hours a day. You will each be escorted by armed security out of an abundance of caution, nothing to be worried about, to make initial observations. I look forward to seeing you there. Let's make history today. Hehe. <laughs> the thing is, like, if they, if they notice me shooting out the lights, then what's the uh, point of shooting out the lights? Maybe it's to, like, set up a more defensive perimeter or something, but... Oh, weapon part. Oh! So now we can put suppressors on anything? How does that work? Oh, that's how that works. Oh, it's like crisis. Fire mode, signal, burst, auto, suppressor, compensator, light, none, laser. Dude. Barrel, suppressor, shock, incendiary, folded stock. Higher recoil, but slightly faster reload times. Oh my god, yes, you can unfold the stock. Less recoil, but slightly slower reload times. I mean, either look is very iconic, but I think... What do you what, what, what do you guys think? Like, are you guys folded stock or unfolded stock? Personally, I'm more for the unfolded stock look. A folded stock looks very good too, but if I had to choose, yeah, this is the way to go. And yes, I'm doing this purely on aesthetic. You're for a folded stock and pathetic? Oh, laser. Oh, hell yeah. We fucking Metal Gear Solid now, boys. Except that I think Snake uses a uh, Mark 23, not the USP. The Mark 23 is the pistol that became the USP, but, you know. Laser is an actor. Oh, yeah, I know that. I just don't know what it stands for. Can I see my laser? Oh, they saw me. Oh, 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 okay, they have me surround us. Actually, kind of hard to see. Oh god. Nice. Oh man, he has a suppressor and laser on the vector. I almost died there because I couldn't see shit thanks to all the fucking smoke and flares. I feel like the game auto saves every corner. Yeah. 
This is a Mark 23 too, according to its own wiki. Oh, really? Interface with drone? Wait, what? User identified subject 106, location Black Site 14 Horizon Corporation. Accessing user memories. Access attempt successful, uploading. Data package, subject 105 termination, upload complete, incoming message. The cycle begins again. Capture means you'll be forced to complete your original mission. End of message, press any key to continue. Wait, what? What the fuck does that mean? Huh? Shoot all the lights out, fuck me! No, you ain't. I like them just kicking around all these corpses. How is this not enough shadow for me to be stealth? Is it because I had a laser? No, the shotgun still. Yeah, okay, I don't know how this works. Nice. Oh my god, he was still like in death animation, I see. Oh shit, that was only his helmet. I only make it harder for me to see. Oh yeah, right, I have a flashlight. Yum kick, motherfucker! Oh shit! your friend Let's go with this one. Nice. 
<laughs> just punch his fucking face off. Alpha three, watch for friendly fire. One oh six is approaching the helipad. Make sure he extracts safely. Oh, that has a scope. Cool. I game like games that's very quiet outside of common and blast metal in the action. Hell yeah. Is the game still like very loud? I think we're good. So friendly, say. So I can trust you guys? All right. If you say so. Raven? That's it, that's the end of the game? No. They got some uh, audio normalization issues with this game. I'll, I'll say that about it. Like, some things are incredibly fucking loud, and then some things that you might have want to be a bit louder, like dialogue, is incredibly quiet. It's just like any good, you know, movie you're watching where you have to, like, turn down the volume for the action scenes and turn up the volume for the dialogue scenes. <laughs> you know? I feel like this game got that issue going for it. Other than that, the gameplay is very fun. Love the sliding. Wait, are we supposed to go in here? Ma'am? Huh? Huh? Oh. No? Oh. Also, let me know if the game is, like, too dark for you guys. I could, like, raise the brightness if needed, but... Yeah, this game is sick. All your issues aside, this game is sick. Okay, if... Customize appearance? Oh yeah, I guess let's get out of this yump suit, eh? Wow! Damn, really? We can choose like our exact like color appearance? What? Oh, some of these you unlock from... Yeah, very hard, rage mode, hard, very hard. Jive, Pineapple Jones, Pizza Time, Smelly. The Epic. Accents White, Accents Gray. Alright, you know, why not let us customize what our character looks like for no apparent reason? I'm into that. Yeah, let's go with the uh, navy blue. Actually, 
Yeah, let's do that. And then we'll do uh, black gloves with uh, green pants and black shoes. Destroy by date, what? There's a bunch of com coordinates. Yes, this is what we do on the stream. We fucking stare very closely at wall textures. If you think you're gonna get anything else from the stream, you would be wrong. It's all wa it's all wa wall textures, baby. Waff third cam, cam not working. Hey, this game is all about the wall textures. Combat simulator. Yo, like VR training? Yo! Yo! Yo, waves? Alright. I guess practice, like, combat in here. That's cool. Dude, I love the kick that you do if you sprint. That's awesome. Oh, can you like jump around like a monkey? If John Wick here gets a licensed movie game, let these devs do it. Yeah. Oh, you can. Oh, it's like Call of Duty where you can like buy weapons and stuff. Like the Call of Duty horde mode in uh, like survival in Modern Warfare 3. Oh, DMR, bolt launcher, grenade launcher, and minigun. But you have to complete certain missions to unlock them. Okay. Tomahawks, rat bombs. Oh, call in allies, smart gun squad. What? Fire bombs, bombs. That works too. Couldn't get behind him to grab him, so you just fucking shoot him. Nice. For well, I exchanged a cloak and a slow mo button together. Oh my god, he 
you set yourself flying like that? Nice! I wonder how I triggered the, uh... Oh, these are also locked? Damn. I wonder how I triggered the, um... Oh! It's a sprint kick that makes you do the drop kick, okay. Or str sprint jump kick. Oh god, they have spawned in my face! I think those blue orbs are where they spawn. Oh, that would make sense, yeah. I should probably buy some more health soon. Dude, the voice lines from the enemies like add so much immersion. I love it. Oh, that reload. Okay, let's buy some health before it's over. Oh no. shield too when I grab him hey I got a riot shield bitch oh my health bar oh shit I'm in front of it Say hello to the ocean! Yeah, I'm sorry, I didn't think about that. Oh god, we're, we're facing elite squad now. Oh, I can still grenade the enemies even though I don't have grenades myself. You use their grenade, I guess. Him. Whee! <laughs> Ten more waves, eh? God, this game is glorious. Back and loaded. 
Oh boy. That rifle did not do as much damage as I was hoping it would. Oh, you can slide into someone and grab them? The waves. I wonder what happens after these guys because these were like the elite, right? Oh, let me guess it's a juggernaut! Oh. Nice. I was trying to be funny. Shit, does that just restart? Oh yeah, I'm not gonna do all 20 of this. this. Return to safe house. Not now. But yeah, that's fun. That's really fun. Alright, let's continue the story. Oh yeah, you step right out of the VR shamer, that's cool. You know, for like having like a task for safe house, where the fuck is everyone? I'm alone? Oh, hey, yeah, here's the sheet menu from before. That's fun. Slight m mission. High value targets. Chief of security. Oh, that's Paul McLellan. Paul Polite McLellan is the chief security site 14. He was brought in to drastically improve security measures at the facility and has quickly gained a reputation for his extreme methods and short temper. While his men fear and dislike him, McLellan's track record for getting results has earned the respect of Horizon senior leadership. Huh. Horizon CEO. I'm not gonna read the description for all these. I, I wanna get to the game. Patriarch? What the fuck? Enforcer. Huh. What the fuck? They got a wizard ass looking guy? Cultist officer. Wait, there's cults and shit? Uh oh. Jackal. Okay, that guy looks badass. Yo, Astro. That's my kind of guy. Yeah, more cultists. Scarecrow. Oh, ghillie suit. Blue sky officer. Oh, yeah, there's Palpatine. Yeah, the chaplain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's Salazar. Alchemist. Infiltrator. Look at the alchemist's face. Wait. Oh my god, he's got fucking teeth on there. Huh. 
Huh. Okay. Yo, yo, there will be a mission in Sweden later? Yo, in Stockholm? What the fuck? Yo, there's a mission that takes place in Stockholm? Google United Kingdom, Yorkshire United Kingdom, Labrador Sea, Arkansas, Horizon Islands, Site 14 was, was taking place in Alaska, Pandora Institute, and a mission in Singapore. We lost content with our undercar agent in this Horizon End of Life care facility. Rated facility and find him. Jasper, Alberta, Canada. The Pandora Institute is a high tech end of life care facility run by Horizon. Our undercar agent, Dr. Emerson, successfully infiltrated the facility but suddenly went silent. Assault the facility with RT of 2017, so find out what's happening and rescue Dr. Emerson if possible. Alright. <laughs> Go to. I go to Pirate Kansas. I can't. Need to complete this mission first. I'll be your pilot from now on. See you at the helipad. Yeah, our pilot is fucking named Raven. I bet that these guys play fucking Armored Core. Supplies. Flashbang sound nice. Oh. All right, I still, I still have my fucking gear on me. Still waiting for Ace of Six. Same dude. Oh, yeah. Laser increased accuracy, but enemies can see the laser and detect you faster. That's why. Although I'm surprised that it didn't work when I like removed the laser, but yeah. I want to, can I customize the SMG? No, I can't. Oh, I'm full of stock, full of stock. Higher recoil, yeah, with a fucking vector. That's abs absolutely what you want. Not. Oh, weapon part. Oh, look. Suppressor for the vector, but I'll keep these two weapons. Pfft, didn't fucking make me targets. Wait, that's good, because then we can check, like, all this memberment parts. So you can blow the head off. You can blow the arms off. And the legs. Oh yeah, they're actually like those ballistic yell targets, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Targets like these like actually can exist. Not sure if I've ever seen like a full body version of one before, but... Here we go. Perfect. Wow, you can see the fucking bones. All right. Yep, yep. All right, have some fun. Wait, what? Oh, he fucking reset it. Body armor, helmet. It's uh, it's a good thing to go looking for like uh, the gun parts. Well, the gun master reset altar. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Time to see a master at work. Oh, that pause. Uh, I was just timing on to check like a quick thing. Sorry about that.
Sorry about that. <laughs> Horizon's good as dead now that you're on the team. Huh, so dialogue lowers the volume of everything else. You know, maybe what I should do is that I should do like higher massive volume and then fucking crank down the effects like a shit ton. Yeah, that fucking shotgun is a little bit too loud. Just shaking all your levels. That's still really fucking loud, dude. Okay, that's acceptable, I think. Let's see, is there uh, ammo here? Oh, I can't accept more shotgun ammo, damn it. Anyway, let's get going, let's get moving. Bulletproof. Let's go. 106 is on board. Coordinates locked. Your objective is to rescue Dr. Emerson. Our intel says he's somewhere in that tower. All right, we're approaching the Pandora Institute. Ooh. Just fucking jump down. Wait, where do I? This is You're never alone, your friends are on the horizon. Damn. Man, this game is really fucking loud. You know what? I'm just gonna fucking even lower the massive volume because like that shit's fucking It's just super fucking loud, dude Like my fucking head is starting to hurt from how loud it is Limb restoration surgery? Hell yeah Huh I now notice that all the voices and stuff are way too fucking loud as well. Yeah, you know what? Let's just, uh, how about we do this? Yeah, that's like way more pleasant for my ears. Right 
Lol, get flashback, nerds. Whoop. And now that voice is almost, uh... And now the voice is almost, like, too low instead. Uh... It also sucks when different YouTube videos have vastly different volumes. Yeah, well, that's just like that depends on like what the creator used to like mix their audio with, right? Breach charges. Thanks, Raven. Gold Palm VIP Dining. Motherfucker, mind your language. Motherfucker. Oh my god, I'm flying. Yeah. Yo, pineapple. I like it when games have like shootable environments stuff. What if just like an achievement for taking care of all these? Damn. Exploded pineapple. It's gone now. I set myself on fire to keep others swarm. Brilliant minds, but short lives, and still are giving us their final days on Earth to help others. The Pandora Institute Horizon. The fuck? You will be remembered. The fuck? This is some creepy ass shit, I'm telling you. Oh, vents. They heard me walking into the glass. Because apparently my fat ass shatters glass. Yeah. I can't get over how fucking far you can fly. God, it's actually kind of fucked up when people like when he when, like when they had a death animation so you're just fucking laying there for a good while it's like damn it almost kind of makes me feel bad <laughs> i just fucking blew his leg off and he's just fucking laying there taking it quotas we need to increase our patient intake and reach our quotas be more aggressive and send the benefits of the pandora institute to, to potential patients use your persuasive skills to recruit patients friends and family as well Remember, the more patients we have, the better it is for science. They're just fucking important, importing old people. Hey, 
AI generated concerts live the life you always dreamed of live your final rocker days with all your friends the world cheated you volunteers you inspire us oh wait volunteers you inspire us the world cheated you and yet you're still standing <laughs> the choice is yours horizon it's all the same fucking bottle Wait, what? Wheelchair accessible mode? Axis Monday. Is Pandora led by Gladys? I have no idea. Yo, look at that fucking reflection though. That's nice. Ooh. Oh, like a proper DMR? Now this is like the Halo C loadout. Sniper and shotgun. Oh, here's my allies. I gotta say, I can't see shit from down here. Am I blind? Nice! What is with the O with the umlaut key? Oh yeah, like uh, for, I had to like bind like uh, another key because it was like complaining about the like another key that I wanted to use as soon was bound on before already being in use. So I just put it on a random fucking key and then I put zoom and right click. So I don't actually use E uh, as it's called to uh, zoom because that would be on the right side of my keyboard, which would be pretty. Uh, um hard to use just fucking stomp him that is a hard button to use where the fuck is the last guy what's going on hey uh, it was it uh. Oh, no? Eight ball, gunslinger, crash, hound, crater, axle. They will be martyrs. What? We call them metal dots in America. Raven and Eighth Ball. They're absolutely Armor Core fans. Doctor Emerson is in that tower. We need to find a way inside. Wall of Heroes. What's up, Pashusu? Oh, shit.
Oh, hello. What's up, buddy? Oh, he's not dead. Oh, now he is. Oh my god, he just fucking walked on him and his fucking leg fucking busted open. Okay. The only place you see them here is on the cover of metal albums. That's pretty funny. Oh shit. <laughs> Wait, suppressor for a shotgun? Oh, you you know I'm gonna go with that. Fuck yeah, dude. We're going stealth now. Oasis Tower incident. Lockdown in effect. We have an incident in the Oasis Towers. Turn on AA guns, lock all ele elevators, activate laser gates. Do not let anyone or anything in or out of the Oasis Towers into further notice. Adrian Berger. Wait, what's his name? Adrian Berger? Did I really say? Oh, yeah, Berger. Right, not Burger. No truck parking. When you have umlauts over uh, over uh, you like that, that's actually like a German Y. Or like an accented Y. All right, let's waltz on out of here. I think the la that last name I think is said pronounced Bursay. What? How do you get Burger to Bursay? Oh, oh. Oh god, Juggernaut. Oh, double Juggernaut. Oh yeah, busted him open. Woo! Oh, that's so satisfying. Nice. I think the DMR can shoot through helmets. America's a melting pot. We have more than just American born folks here, so we have some Frenches here too. Oh yeah, I absolutely know about that. I mean, you're seeing Swedish people that like immigrated to America like way back, right? I know all about that shit. Oh, trip mines. Well, that's very like Half-Life 2 style trip mines. Oh my god, what? Mm. 
No scope. Yeah. It goes straight through the helmet. There's a sweet who moved to France a couple of years ago named by name Martin Molin. Never heard of. Uh, Mar Martin Molin, I guess. Turn off. Hmm. Oh yeah, right. Oh yeah, winter, winter, winter Right, right, right. Oh shit. I did not have slow motion available. Or focus, I guess it's called, but you know. Yeah, I know who uh, uh, Wintergarten is, yeah. Hello. <laughs> well, and that's the HVT, just like that. Yeah, I'm gonna expand this DMR and pick up this pistol. Actually, oh no, I'm oh, oh wait, I dropped the fucking DMR or shotgun. Shotgun! Where's my customer shotgun? Oh no! Fuck! Where did it go? Whatever. I don't need a silent shotgun. We did. All teams, this is Ghost One Actual. We secured the entrance to the Pandora Institute. Ghost Two should already be in there, sir. Try and link up with them. Supplies. I just wonder what happened to my shotgun. Yeah, this game is really fun. I really enjoy this. But, uh, my shoddy? No need to worry about us, sir. Oh, yeah, here's a DMR. I don't even know, man. I'm not worrying about you guys. I'm looking for my fucking shotgun. Due to changes in the testing schedule, the party Welcome to the Pandora Institute. It took a lot of guts for you volunteers to sign up here. And for that, you have my gratitude. Countless lives will be saved because of your selflessness. Is that Gianni Matrigrano? I fucking think it is. High value target Samaritan. I think I saw Shit. Check your fire! Check your fire, asshole! He's got a hostage! 
<laughs> do do me do me do do. Oh my god, no! I was gonna grenade him when I got up close. Oh, that works. Huh? That was anticlimactic. Oh, he's still alive. I don't think he's alive anymore. <laughs> oh, that's too much fun. Do do be do be do 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 ba do be do do. You know, this is my new buddy. We're gonna go out this Friday. We're gonna have a couple of drinks. Atrium situation report from Dr. Felix Borden or Borden. We have too many wounded in the atrium. Medical supplies insufficient. Guards are banned in the post and running. Not sure from what. Situation is not under control. Need immediate assistance and medical supply. Oh. They are all dead. So much for Horizon, I guess. Handle with care. I guess I'm supposed to go, yeah, towards the green light. I'm just making sure, you know, that I don't miss any weapon parts, because... Yeah, you know, I like my weapon attachments. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be any here. Okay, you know, that's a that's a pretty uh tall place. Yo, blue screen? This is not a test. Lockdown is in effect. Report to designated locations. Lock all doors and wait for instructions. The fuck? Okay, what is this? Why is spooky music? Um... What? I'm staring at the dicks, I'm looking at them. There's something fucked up going on here. This is checkpoint Maxwell. Where the hell are those engineers? Situation's getting critical down here. Checkpoint Maxwell, this is RP Sigma. There's no way the tech team can arrive with that lockdown active. What the fuck? Instead of jumping off a cliff, you can jump into Horizon's arms. Volunteers need a Pandora Institute Horizon. What the fuck is this? Uh oh. Love is eternal. AI reproduce personalities. What the fuck? I don't know why it's like 
the way that these art pieces are set up, it's like, you know... Yeah, it's like kind of positive, but like there's something so off about that. Making wishes come true before I passed away, I got to sell my first screenplay, Midsummer Morning. Cure and blindness, see your loved ones again. Braille's a soon to be dead language. Hmm. Yeah, there's like, it's like, you know, it's like it tries to be positive, but like the way that the art is made, like composed and stuff, it comes off more as creepy than anything, you know? One zero six, man of the hour. I'll get that elevator unlocked for you. There. I got it. Thanks. According to the schematics, this elevator is going to take you straight to the basement. It's probably flooded with grunts right now, but that shouldn't be a problem for a super soldier. I got to get back to my team. Good luck. All right, see you, man. <laughs> Uh-oh. Wait over limit? What? Oh no, now the spooky stuff begins. Welcome to site 97. Well then. Flooded with grunts, eh? They're all dead. Yeah, this is game very dead spacey. It looks like a security lockdown is in effect. We need to find a way to disable it. Holy shit. Emergency care. Conflicted scientist email. Subject from Alex L. Shine 98 to Alex L. Shine 98 from Robert C. Kramer. Subject focus on research. I understand that you may have concerns about the morality of our research, but it's important to, uh, to remember the potential benefits for thousands of lives. We, do ha we have a duty to push the boundaries of medicine and science, and it's essential that we do not let personal feelings get in the way of progress. Remember that our ultimate goal is to save lives and improve humanity as a whole. Regards, Dr. Robert Kramer. Okay. That didn't work. Ah, I need to find a vent, I see. Where can we find a vent entrance? When the subject 106 is sus. Wait, who? Wait, what? This is Half Life? Yes. Patience, last message. Dear parents, I hope this message finds you well. You must be worried about my well-being since I haven't contacted you in some time. 
I'm doing fine, but my illness is in its final stages, and unfortunately, I will pass away soon. As much as I would like to hear from you, please respect my privacy at this time. You'll receive my belongings and some forms to require your signatures on my behalf. Please sign those forms and mail them back. It means a lot to me. Your child, Devin. I have a good feeling that uh, Devin did not write that mail. Oh shit, hello. locked patient expo what the fuck okay the effects on a human subject were catastrophic upon exposure the subject's dna was rapidly rewritten causing grotesque mutations and physical de deformations the subject was immediately the soul was immediately transformed. Its skin took on a green, sickly green hue, becoming blistered and swollen and oozing a thick green liquid. Behavior became increasingly violent and erratic. It is unclear whether this was a result of the mutation itself or a side effect of the pain and discomfort caused by the changes to their body. Despite these horrific effects, brain scans revealed that the soul's cognitive abilities appear to remain intact, although severely impaired. They were able to process some information and make limited decisions as evidenced by reactions to physical and verbal stimuli. Unfortunately, the subject did not survive for long after the mutation began. The gas spill caused by mutation eventually led to a massive explosion, killing the subject. Huh. And th 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 that ain't good. Hello? Guess we'll just push on. Nothing on these computers. Uh oh. Bloody footprints. Oh, and handprints. Nice. Oh, probably puked out some blood. Nice. We like that. We like that. Find Dr. Emerson. Checkpoint Darwin. Search Maxwell. Last seen by Unit Denver. Conrad. Search Sentinel. Search Odessa. Search Safar Safari. Searched servers. Oh, here's the, uh. I don't like the fact that this implies that something else has crawled into the vent before me. Facility locked and active, okay. I'm pretty sure this is bulletproof. Oh. Amazed by how well his markers mark the walls. That's a necro, yeah. So locked on slip the board, where do I go? Oh, I'm on my way to the right track. It's all locked. Oh. Oh, 
hell no. Yeah, um... Oh! Okay, that wasn't too bad. Even the rest is more tight now? Wait, what do you mean? We got 1080. We had 1440p on YouTube. Yes, yeah, saying. But we don't anymore because I had to stream and kick. Oh, so hello, Yaros. I think we might also be getting into Resident Evil territory. I think so too. Black Side 97 accessing user memories. Access attempt successful uploading. Data package, Pandora Institute, evidence of anomalous research, upload complete. It was never going to be a rescue mission. Downloading file confidential 9713 brought to Robert C. Kramer from Anton Lazar, CEO. We have a defector. Our last two containment breaches were no coincidence. Laboratories 13A and 13F are both adjacent to maintenance access delta. Only one person in recent access logs, Dr. Emerson. Recommend co covert, su co covert, su covert surveillance until we find out who he's working for. And a message. Huh. So. Up. Oh. Fucking. When corpses glitch around like that, like it's always kind of funny, but also heckin' weird. Pfft. Wee! <laughs> Wee! Okay, that door's locked. More lore. Black Ops mission log. Ooh, hell yeah. 0100. Black Ops Team Falcon approached a barn where barn where syndicate operators were operators were hiding. One, one 0103. Falcon breached the barn's defenses and engaged in a firefight with the operatives. 0140. Syndicate's op operators were neutralized and barn was secured. O200, during SSE, a large metal crate at dimensions approximately 5 by 5 meters were discovered. O440, Falcon started the crate loaded onto Flight Horizon 219, headed to Pandora Institute for further study. <laughs> that may add to the hardest than a Tencent Dark Area trip for a corpse and jump scares you. I don't know, it, it's kind of like more silly than anything, but you know, it will probably happen. Pandorium? What the fuck is that? Discover the discovery of a new oh Jesus the discovery of a new organic biomaterial has the potential to revolutionize the energy industry. This biomaterial designated pandorium is derived from organic resources and has the ability to consume and convert a wide range of organic matter into a highly efficient and stable source of energy. Pandorium also has the added benefit of being able to clean up and neutralize a wide range of hazardous materials, making it a valuable tool in the field of environmental cleanup. Furthermore, preliminary testing has shown that Pandorium has the potential to be used in the medical field as well. It has been observed to have a healing effect on wounds and accelerate the repair of damaged tissue. Man, I, I don't know what the fuck about you, but I don't want this shit in my blood. Get that shit away from my wounds. I'll take stitches any day. The fuck? Huh. God damn it, there's a lot of intel. Corporate pressure. To Pandora Institute research staff from Anton Lazar. Team, I cannot stress enough the importance of thoroughly testing and evaluating our biomaterial before releasing it to the public. We must not compromise the safety and well-being of our customers for the sake of beating our competition to market. 
I urge you all to remain vigilant and to prioritize the safety of our people above all else, Anton. All right. All personnel, reminder. Report to checkpoint Maxwell for immediate sterilization. Right point Sigma? Sigma what? Yo, fresh coffee? Hot? $8.50 for a fucking hot dog? What the hell? That's gotta be some fucking hot dog. I don't know about you guys. Oh no. Oh, this ain't good. Oh shit. There's a lot of them. Oh, that's satisfying. Holy shit, I'm being fucking swarmed. At least they're not spinning all over the place. All day breakfast from 10.99. Oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. God, that jump kick never gets old. I love it so much. Kinda wanna take my pistol back, yeah. Oh, it only has five shots? Oh, shit. Well, better five shots and a pistol than no ammo and a shotgun. Oh, there's the, my old pistol, never mind. Fresh bakery scrolls, mud cake. Dude, those scrolls look awesome. Big breakfast salad. Pizza. Six dollars for french fries. What? DJGN cream super? What? <laughs> Decagon, I guess. Decagon cream super. <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny. Yeah, this shit is overpriced. Yo, beef burger, 12 bucks. Pancakes, 13 bucks. What the fuck? Pizza, 15. Man, inflation struck hard in this place, huh? Scamflation. Man, this place is fucked up. I bet you they don't pay their employees enough to afford to eat here. Yeah, it wouldn't even surprise me, dude. Wouldn't even surprise me if there was a yum scare down in this hallway, because that would be like true fear. No, nothing? Okay. Well, at least there's no signs of a fucking ghost girl, so you know, we're all good. It's all good, man. Situation fucked reactor overrun can't find Emerson Yeah, it's like a little bit too quiet
Oh, well. You don't pay seventeen dollars a month for utility. Why should we pay multiple people seventeen dollars a month for something we already can do? Sounds like capitalism. Oh, recharge right here. Oh, hello. Yep, I knew there would be a yum scare. Still got me. Oh, what the fuck? This shit just hurts to stand in. Run! Oh, dead end. Oh, God. I'm gonna fucking die. Let me out. <laughs> Dr. Emerson. I think it's dead. dead. There's nothing we can do for him. Pick up his flash drive. Rip. Another one of those fucking coins. Your next objective is to destroy the subject. Horizon's gone too far. We can't let this thing escape. All right. Arm up, you know, I like the way you think, lady. Let's see, we got DMR, assault rifle. I mean, you know we're going with the shotgun. Honestly, the fucking DMR fucking rocks. Wait, that's not the DMR, this is. What the fuck? Yeah, we got fucking boost back here. It seems very irresponsible to place the bar right next to the armory, but what do I know? Unfold the shotgun. And we're not going quiet for this one. Oh man, I wish we could have the iron sights. I don't like more weapon parts. You'll be coming up on Horizon's experimental bioreactor soon. What about number 95 signifies? I have no idea. Yeah, you know I have to go with the unfolded stock because it just looks so much better. Alert. Maintenance team required at reactors one, two, three, and four. Hey, one second. Oh shit, apparently there's a risk for thunder. I really hope I don't have to cl close the stream down. Watch that not kill the subject. I know, right? Hello. By the way, I'm, I'm just gonna check if someone has fallen on kick just in case because it hasn't been notifying me for some reason the past few times. No, okay. Nothing. Yeah, it's making sure. All right. Get those laser gates turned on ASAP. Just heard from the eggheads. If just one of these things can inside the reactor, this whole place is going up in flames. Hmm. 
Doink. <laughs> I wish you could make the movement like normal movement speed just a tad bit faster. I I know that they want to like uh, a reward aggression with like giving you more sprint stamina, but it just feels kind of weird how. I can like go kind of fast for a few seconds and then I'm completely out of breath and then like I have to walk at a fucking snail's pace. Wait, what the fuck? Where do I go? Oh wait, maybe I have to backtrack since I disactivated or deactivated the uh, laser gates. Man, I don't remember. Wait, was it over here? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. See, I'm smart. I find the F as the use button weird. Really? I mean, I, re I know that the games used to do like E normally, but then Call of Duty kind of came along and started to use the F button as use because you had to use Q and E for leaning in the first games. And then it just kind of just became uh, like regular because it's like, it's not like you have to have quick access to uh, the use key, right? Wait, so what do they want me to throw per oh, wait No, they want me to throw enemies into these reactors, but there's no enemy spawning Oh wait Ah, I see get yeah, okay I see, so wait, how do I grab them? Oh, yes, like that. Whee! Oh, maybe that one's already done. Oh, come here. Yeah, come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Wait, one more? Oh, shit, over there. Well, that was easy. Oh, not you again. Yes, we're running. Ah! Run! Go! He's not even behind me. This is both. Ah! <laughs> okay, never mind. He is. He is behind me. <laughs> I was like, he's not chasing me. I don't have time for that now. Oh, we got a weapon part? No? Just medkits? Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yo, he's fucking blocking with his wings. are getting closer and closer oh shit
Wait, did I die or did I not die? What's with the white line? Huh, that was weird. Yes, we didn't die. One week since your escape, and you've already destroyed one of my facilities. Allow me to make one thing clear, Six. You were never supposed to be a weapon. We're clearing out the rest of the Horizon survivors now. We'll arrive momentarily. Elevator's coming up. Wait. I'm picking up a signal from 106. Hello? You're still with us. We're almost done, just getting everyone ready to extract. It's gonna be one hell of a debrief. I... Again, like, the fucking... I, I wish that the dialogue... Like, yeah, I have cried up a bit already. I wish that the dialogue wasn't tied to, like, the rest of the voice lines in the game, because it's like... It can be so quiet at times. He's on his way now to pick you up first. He'll see you at the helipad. That's like my only complaint about this game so far is that the audio mixing is very, very weird. And like, I know that you can like mix it yourself with like all the sliders and shit, but it still doesn't really help. Uh oh. Oh, shoot the weak spots. I gotcha. Mothman. Well. Uh oh. Oh, they were just instantly transformed just like that. Well. Here goes my friends. Ow, 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 ow. Woo! Come here, bitch. Don't come here, bitch. Uh oh. There we go. That's what Horizon's hiding behind closed doors. Monsters. Uncontrollable experiments. All hell breaking loose in the roof facilities. Did the reactors kill? Well, no, I just shot it to death. Saying their research will change the world. That's why we're here. To correct their mistakes one black side at a time. There we go. Now it's dead. Open that shit up. This is Raven. We're out of here. All right, let's fucking go. Yes, your prediction came true. Now that you know what we're up against, I have to show you something. TF27 safe houses. Also, I just hate how dialogue also is fucking like quiet everything down i don't know like the audio is super fucking weird i don't know man it's like really annoying that it does shit like this kind of takes me out of it you know they gotta fix that shit bet you tier 27 leaders one of those 
Nah. That would be stupid. But like, see, it only does it for like some dialogue. Oh wait, it did for that one too. Yeah, the fucking audio is a nightmare in this game. Also, I'm just gonna check if Kick has the Trepang uh, category yet, but I don't think it does. No. Or does it? Let me refresh. I know of a game where even if the dialogue is muted, the audio still dims down. Oh yeah, I think... Uh, I don't remember what game it is, but I know that there's a game that does it. Except the audio are finding game good. Yeah, it's like very fun. Like... It, it's, it's basically fear mixed with crisis when it comes to like the gunplay itself. It's very fun. Hmm. All right. Well, I guess if they if, if if they made an entire room about this, then there's not gonna be a mission where we don't go down here and activate it and and uh, run out. But uh, thanks for telling me beforehand that we have a thermonuclear warhead on our hands. Sorry, Subject 106, but can you, like, uh, fucking nuke us in, just in case they find us? <laughs> Boop! Not now! <laughs> the plot seems to be also, like, kind of weird and funky in a cool way. I like it. Data package redacted. Upload completed. She's not telling you everything. End the message. Alright. Who are these drones and why are they trying to tell me stuff? I wonder if we unlocked any new uh, appearances. Nah, I don't think so. Not that, like, appearance as a single-player game fucking uh, matters at all, but... I just think it's very funny that they decided to, uh... Like, put the effort in, like, doing that shit. Because, like, yeah, you can see your body, I guess. Wait, you can fucking wall jump? Damn. No, the game is like uh, literally three hours old. Like it's brand new. <laughs> literally just came out. Damn it, I'm trying to see if I can like... W oh wait, there's a fucking ceiling here. I want to see if I can like set myself flying with the wall kicks. Yeah, probably not. I kind of worked. Yeah, like, depending on, like, what angle you do it on. It kind of sends you flying. It reminds me of Fear, because I think you could do, like, shit like that in that game, too. Actually, you could kind of wall run in Fear, which was cool. Anyway, enough goofing around. Alright, we, we can go to uh, Gunnar Sun Complex, which is in Stockholm, Sweden. We can go to Yorkshire, or we can go to Singapore. I'm gonna go to fucking Stockholm, Sweden, of course. Oh, these are side missions, I see. So these two are side missions, and this is the main campaign. Well, we'll go to fucking Stockholm. Located just in the outskirts of Stockholm, the Gunnar Sun Complex is the center for Horizons Intelligence gathering in Europe. The data house will bring us valuable insight into Horizons operations. Assault to facilitate and retrieve encrypted data from the servers. The frontal assault method isn't my kind of strategy. But sometimes you need shock and awe to throw the enemy off balance. 
Yorkshire, Yorkshire. No, Yorkshire. I refuse to say Yorkshire. Nah, -uh. it's Yorkshire. That's how it's pronounced. Yeah, I know Yorkshire. Go kick some ass. Thanks, Quartermaster. Let's put a Metallica games on it. Put it, it'll do a trick. Yorkshire, yeah. What if I pronounce Stockholm and Stockholm? Stockholm. Well, I, I can say I can say that St uh, Stockholm is not actually pronounced Stockholm, but it's pronounced Stockholm. So you know. Also, I don't care if you mispronounce Stockholm because while it's cool that Stockholm is in a video game, Stockholm sucks. I would never go to Stockholm. Hey, they, they missed the fucking umlauts or the fucking A. We've got things under control. I've already dispatched a security team. No need to worry. Hey, well, Coleman. Don't be worried. Are you fucking kidding me? What's going on in the background? I was I was paying too much attention to fucking this, not having its umlauts. Valkommen. It's not how you say Valkommen. Valkommen. Deception. I'm gonna read everything that's supposed to be Swedish in Swedish. Actually, I kind of wish I brought a pistol instead of this DMR. I could just pick that one up, but like the DMR is like kind of valuable though. Let us plan your wedding. Your best day needs the best support for rice, and we got your six. Huh? Fuck. These, these fucking ads are so weird. I take it they didn't have a way to add us umlauts. It's literally fucking... It's a fucking wall texture. They can put two fucking dots over over the fucking A. They could literally make the dots fucking separate. I don't give a shit. Refund, the game sucks now. Can't even pronounce Swedish words right. I fucking know, right? Please. Please. Please, Trapang devs. Fix your umlauts. Literally unplayable. Consolidation kills small businesses. Think about your local communities. Think about the D. Think about the your economy. What? That's a misspelling. Think who will protect you. Horizon will protect your independence. Oh shit. Person of the year. Race magazine. Interviewer, Anton, what, you are the world's first trillionaire and the founder of Horizon Corporation. Wait. Horizon Corporation? If, if, if I had a fucking... If I had a fucking dollar for every time uh, an evil mega corporation was named Horizon in a video game, I would have two dollars. Which isn't much, but it's weird it's happened twice. That looks like Bezos plus Tate plus Bruce Willis. Anyway, the world's largest and most successful tech company. What are your attributes to your success? It's an honor to be respected for my hard work and success in my company, but the true credit goes to the people that I work with, which none of this would be possible without. We strive to make a difference. Our flagship product, Horizon OS, is the future of problem solving in a fast evolving world. With its advanced AI technology, it predicts problems and finds solutions before they even happen. Can you tell us about your goals for world peace? World peace is at the core of Horizon's values. We are better at defense and de-escalation than any military while also being more efficient and cost effective. Doesn't sound like a tech company to me. We are committed to making the world a safer place for everyone. 
It's impressive to see a defense company with such noble goals. Wait, they just said it were a tech company. How do you achieve this in practice? We use cutting edge AI to predict and prevent conflicts before they even happen. Our superior logistics allows us to deploy entire divisions to end location within hours, not weeks. We work closely with governments and other organizations to find peaceful solutions. Defense and peace go hand in hand, that's why we strive to be the best in both. You can you tell us about the company's recent pivot into research in anomalous sciences? We have come a long way in terms of machine pieces to build and it's time for the next big thing. The newly discovered field of anomalous sciences is an exciting area that studies phenomenon that studies phenomenon defying the laws of known science. That's a big shift we may decide to pivot in this direction. We believe that this technology has the potential to change the world for the better and we want to be at the forefront. Our goal is to democratize this technology and make it available to everyone, not just the elite few. God, this is so tech company. Speech is amazing. Expect us to, expect to see us continue to push to to continue to push the boundaries of what is possible and developing technologies that will change the world for a better. To find the laws and known signs. Shut up, B movie. Yeah, exactly. Fucker. Also, I have no idea why the game feels like it needs to fucking play dubstep when I'm trying to read shit. Oh, hello. Wait, I literally just checked this menu. You know, I was thinking there would be a lot more enemies in here. Wait, hack server? Oh, right. Yo. We got glass technology. Nice. I like to use the like most stock sound effect possible for this. Anyway. Ah, oh, yes. Wait. <laughs> the fucking monitor. Monitor brand is hell instead of Dell. That's funny. Oh, that's, that's pretty funny. That's actually really, really fucking funny. All right, let's hack this shit. Oh shit. Sick. Explode quicker. Oh, collateral, collateral, collateral. Boom. Ah. You hate Freebird? Why? Maybe I should have thrown this out before they started storming. Next 
Oh, next one. Oh my god, I just wasted all these fucking mines on nothing. Oh, he walked into a mine. Oh, that blew the chair across the room. Let's grab on a vector, shall we? Nice. Bro, next guy into mine. Wait, I can do that. We can do that. <laughs> Wait, where's the server I gotta hack? Oh, fuck, in the other room. Yeah, you're a super soldier, yeah. What's it look like? Also, I can go stealth. You never know. I mean, I'm hardly human. Wait, interference detected? Oh, through the wall. I'm not being mean. Did I come across as mean? I didn't mean to, baby. Oh. I see, it's more like a wave mission. Oh man, I wish I could get the mini gun. Fuck it, let's do some pistol action. That's always cool. I'm not yelling at the arrows. Like a fucking mission mod. That's so satisfying. Lots of high value Taris in here. I like how he just fucking kicked him in his face and oh god damn, look at that bullet. That's meaty. Make a, make a living grenade out of him. Just give me a fucking shotgun or something. Oh, 
Oh, that's what I'm the grenade. Oh. Let's just buy more ammo. Oh god. Oh no! Are you kidding me? Fuck! Really? A grenade? Fuck me. Oh. Fucking balls. Oh, and that's me detonating myself with the grenade. Yeah, I don't like the fact that the grenades don't explode on impact, man. The fact that they take a bit to detonate despite being the right hit just fucks with me so bad. All right, motherfucker. Let's just waste the grenade launcher. I don't care for it. There we go. Oh no, I want to grab him. Fuck. Yo, he's got fucking Captain America shield. Oh shit. this shit again the vector rips at a close distance but like if you, if you start to get like at, at like any distance whatsoever then like oh man does it not perform Stop squirming. Actually, shotgun with low ammo. Now. Let's just do the rifle. Towards the next hacking point. There it is. Oh shit. Yeah, I'm glad I got the rifle now because these guys have armor.
Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I don't want to be here. Oh boy. Oh, he's fucking heavily armored. Oh, never mind. He's fucking dead. Yeah, I love how like grabbing people is just free grenades basically Like if you grab them and then press the throw uh, like the grenade button You'll toss them with their own grenade active so That's why I'm taking a lot of hostages Plus they just block bullets for you Which is great when you are trying to regenerate stuff Stuff being focused so you can go slow mo. Oh, that didn't hit. Fuck. Oh my god, I spammed the pistol a little bit too fast. Man, the pistol animations are top fucking tier. I gotta have a laser size of this weapon. Shit! Maybe not worth, maybe not worth. Fuck, how do I get up? Oh, suppressed and laser vector. Yes, please. Oh yeah, close range though? Yeah, nothing beats the fucking... Uh... Wait, high value target? Where? He's trying to escape, I need to find him. I saw the tag for him, but it's okay, we got a checkpoint. I had a feeling that he's like trying to escape. Get to the extraction point. I'm waiting for you on the rooftop. I don't know why I want to kill him, but there is a fucking list of like high value targets in the game. Armor, health. There we go. There he is, there he is. And I got him. Dude, don't fucking axe kick me, bro. I snap your fucking neck. Pull down your trouser. Snap your dick in half. Okay, we're getting the fuck out of here. Woo. Excellent work, sir. Horizon deserved everything you gave them. Nice. That was fucking intense. Love it. Heard Horizon bitching and crying over the comms. You sure pissed them off. Hell yeah, buddy. Welcome back. One zero six. 
Mm, where's the weapons at? Wait, did I walk past it? Oh, yeah. Mm, no attachments for this yet. Yeah, let's just do a fucking suppressed pistol with a rifle. Gotta complete Jorvik Castle to apparently unlock a bolt launcher and a shotgun. So, uh, yeah, that's the top priority. Yeah, that's next campaign mission, I see. Alright, let's do it. Yorkshire, United Kingdom, York Castle. Dr. Emerson's files show Horizon was sending scientists and biological materials to this castle in the UK. The castle is owned by a violent and heavily armed cult. The cult leaders, known only as Patriarch and Enforcer, must be eliminated. Intel suggests a high ranking Horizon scientist, Dr. Kramer, is to conduct research at the temple. Our orders are to kill or capture. Do do ba do be do do. God, I love how quiet that is. Those cultists are a bunch of freaks. You'll see what I'm talking about. Hmm. Thanks for a vote of confidence, quartermaster. Load times are fucking fast, at least. Oh shit, just drops us right into the action, eh? Oh yeah, now we're getting fucking Resident Evil 8 vibes, eh? Okay, maybe we should try to stealth this shit. Guess we'll just jump. Oh, weapon part. Oh, suppressor for the rifle? Yes, please. No, for the DMR. Oh, that's almost even better. Hell yeah. Alright, we're actually gonna try to stealth this shit. Oh. checking so I'm not missing anything but I don't think I am enemies out in the courtyard eh I don't see shit sir oh wait yo cultist with a gun I see free. So if we, uh, nice shot. All right. Oh, fourth guy. Wait, cover's blown. I can't see me up here. My, the dot in the middle of my screen doesn't exist. That means I'm invisible. Clear. Oh, okay. Works for me. Oh, Intel, it's a fucking scroll. Patriarch speech transcript. With each passing day, our judgment comes ever closer. 
Once a band of dozen nomads waging war from the shadows for millennia, swelling their ranks with vanquished foes, merging man with machine, the unyielding cabal enslaves all. Beyond our walls they roam unmolested, amongst common folk undetected. Infiltrating the highest seas of power, soon they will emerge and besiege our holy sanctuary. We must remain vigilant, uphold our oath to the maker, we go as one towards our destiny. Oh boy. Yep, sounds like cultists, alright. Wait, that's literally what I just said. It's literally reading what I just said. What a copycat. Are we just supposed to jump down? Is that the only way down? Fuck, I guess. Yep. Alright. Yep, that's the Animatra Ground for sure. Uh oh. So much for stealth. You will die <laughs> Whoops, wrong button. Oh god. Oh god, I have suicide bombers. Well, he fucking went. Man, the silence pistol is so fucking badass. Oh! That feels sick. Whoa! What the fuck? Yeah, they gotta like tune down the uh, like player physics just a little bit. It just feels a little bit extreme that I like barely touch something with my feet and it just fucking explodes, dude. It's like, yeah, I mean, it's like like not uh, big of a deal, but it just it's a bit immersion breaking, you know. Yo, that's a piece of brain. Oh. Hell yeah. Spectre 2 deployed. We'll keep this courtyard secure. Good luck in there, 106. Yeah, I have a feeling that this... Enforcer 106. I have a feeling that the... See what I mean with the audio in this game? Their fucking landing noises are like 900 times louder than the helicopter. What the fuck? As I was trying to say, I take the shotgun over to DMR because I feel like there's gonna be close quarters up ahead. Oh my god, someone clipped that shit. Helicopter, super silent. Fucking foot soldier landing. Kaboom! Yo, is this a firebomb? Why, yes it is. But I'm gonna take my five grenades first. Oh, that's terrible. Hmm. There's a whole bunch of supplies laying around. I wonder if there's another gun part laying around here somewhere. Probably not. Oh. Wait. Okay, that's cool. Long barrel folded stock. Interesting. Oh. <laughs> well, that's that body armor. 
Jesus, I'm jump scaring myself by fucking walking into benches. Man, you better not fucking let 106 sit on you because he's gonna fucking. He's gonna murder your ass with that ass. Oh my god. The fucking power of the ass shakes in this man. Like, he's just gonna take a sit. Or take a seat. Take a sit. What the fuck? All right, let's see what's in here. Our holy ground. Kill them. All teams, 106 is hunting down the enforcer. Nothing, no one, hello? Oh, more intel. Beware, like those you destroy, you too shall come. That's a weird aesthetic in that picture, but I like it. You know what this reminds me of? Not Resident Evil, but the evil within. That's a uh, tomahawk. And of course you can pick it back. Huh. Yeah, we're just gonna rock the tomahawk. Fuck it. Ooh. The Holy Father and I will watch over you. I wonder if he has seen me. Well, that didn't make the room any less bright. I guess there's too much natural light coming in to really affect things. Do do ba do be do do. Like, how dark does it have to be for me to actually become invisible? Because, like, I feel like this should be plenty dark. Apparently not. Like a game with a weird stealth mechanic, I don't know. Like, how is this not enough shadow? Fuck it, we're not here to stealth. Walk softly, brothers. The non-believers are hunting. Ooh. <laughs> that felt pretty brutal. I think I saw something. Yeah, the, the enemy. Oh my god, are you okay? Oh my god, the tomahawk is the best. Three sixty. No. Three sixty. No. What the fuck? Oh god, that's a Susa bomber. Ah! Oh, ow! I didn't do this. This was their own doing. Yes, sir, we're clear. Come on, I gotta hit at least one 360 or else I'm not a man. <laughs> that's my prerequisite to becoming a man. One, hit the 360. That's it. 360! Yeah! Yeah, sure, poop. Who are you calling poop? I don't want to read that in the middle of combat. Oh, wait. Right, it pauses. That's a pretty badass picture. I wish you could get the sword. Many moons ago, we were led by a council of elders, but it was not long before a powerful em figure emerged, known as the Patriarch. Under his rule, we have become a formidable force, waging war against the nefarious Cabal. Cabal? Cabal? 
Oh, I have two her uh, tomahawks now. Oh, in the ass. Again, if the stream is a bit too dark, let me know, guys. Because, like, I can kind of see. But it's hard to see for me, even. Maybe that is a sign that I should yak up the brightness. No! Fuck! Oh, shit! My holy weapon's empty. What are these guys? Fucking Warhammer... Guys. Fuck! Here we go. Fine brightness for me, all right. Space Marines aren't the cult. <laughs> yeah, right? It's not like they're worshiping like a holy corpse or anything. Okay, where's the last guys? My precious warrior monks, you are right seeking answers. As your supreme patriarch, I provide an enlightenment. I witness you grow from humble peasants into noble crusaders. Every day you sharpen your swords, sharpen your minds, purge blasphemous influences from your lives. Today you face the enemy with unflinching resolve. In your, even in your final fiery breast show no doubt or hesitation destruction of the cabal is imminent to arms my holy warriors to arms oh shit yo that guy did a fucking front flip Oh, that kind of makes me interested um, in the a hey, holy almost corpse. Exactly, my bad. Yeah, 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 long barrel full of stock. But if we go to the customization menu here, we should be able to get a unfull of stock and long barrel. There we go. Seems pretty good to me. Sustain fire becomes more accurate, but but much higher recoil and slight accuracy penalty on the first few shots. Oh, okay. That's kind of weird, but we'll try it. Spectre three infiltrated through the balcony, moving to search the mausoleum for Doctor Kramer. Good luck bagging the enforcer one oh six. Yeah, again, like, I really, really dislike the dialogue. Like, taking away the volume. It's like, okay, they're walking in, you hear gunshots, and they start talking, and then it's like, okay, what's really going on here? I have no idea. It's like, okay, well, obviously, they dropped down the balcony and shot a few guys, but... Eh, I don't know, when, when, when you literally mute, like, sound effects like that, it so takes me away from it, you know? Stop it. Don't do that. If they, if they can fix the audio in this game, it would be, like, an easy 9 out of 10. Wait, was that the Patriarch? No way, right? <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Oh, I love stealth mechanics when you can just abuse them like that. Ooh, what the fuck? Cultist journal entry free. Okay, so that explains where you can probably see the teeth in that guy. 
It has been several months since I joined. I have been filled with fear and doubt, but I have kept the faith. I have given all my all to the patriarch, and he has seen fit to bless me with a child. But alas, my dear wife did not survive the birth. I have been initiated, and my mask shall be nailed to my face as a symbol of my devotion. I know now that the patriarch knows what is best for me and my child, and I shall trust in his wisdom. I have given my all, and I have no regrets. Yeah. Yeah. That's, uh... Yeah. That's fucked up. Where to go? Wait, maybe I should just continue down that hall where I just assassinated those two guys. Yeah, probably right. My bad. <gasps> God damn, my dude. Fuck that. Oh. Yeah, that long barrel's pretty nice. Patriarch's message to martyrs. Jesus Christ, that art goes hard. What the fuck? That's so fucked up. My dear martyrs, remember that there's no greater end than immolation with the enemy. Though you will not join us on our great journey to ascension, your sacrifice will be remembered and honored forever. Your death will pay the way for you and the glory of our people. This is such a Scientologist. I will become a martyr for the crusade. Today I, I learned to make powerful firebombs to destroy my enemies and bring about true unity among my brothers. This is the end of my journal and the beginning of my legacy. Jesus. I'm just expecting one of these doors to have a guy pop out of him. Uh oh. Oh, there we go. Oh, 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 I need fucking. Yeah, let's go with that. Oh, what the fuck? He stealthed away? Oh, shit! Love doing that. <laughs> Apparently, it doesn't give a shit about burning. Oh, boy. Works for me. Oh. Oh. This is a fucked up minigun, but I like it. 
It's a fucking LMG with a minigun barrel. Man, this funky thing is funky as fuck. Director, we've got unidentified helos closing in fast. Oh shit, it's Horizon! They're landing everywhere! We'll try to hold them off, but we're going to need backup ASAP! Copy that. All teams fall back to the courtyard. We gotta keep that LZ secure. Affirmative. We're on our way. Come on, you sorry sack of shit. I'm not a child! I can walk on my own! Check your fire. We'll go VIP to look out for. Oh. Oh, I don't have slow mo. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, that works. Black Ops mission. Get in, get the doctor, and destroy any of the evidence of Horizon ever being here. Leave no witnesses. No delays, no hesitation. Good luck. Bayonets? Dude. Smart gun scope? Dude. I want that. Just make sure we ain't missing any weapon parts. Huh? The fuck? Oh, the cultists are fighting them at the same time as us. This gun, this gun fucking rocks is something that needs to rev up, obviously. Nice. Enforcer's doomsday plan. What? Oh damn, look at that. The fixed stone wall shall protect me and mine from radiation. I shall stock provisions of food, water, and medicine. I shall also tend a garden within the courtyard and teach my companions to purify water and forage for sustenance. Discipline and order shall be upheld for survival of us all. Good doomsday plan, I guess. Sounds pretty basic, but... Not sure if it's worth starting a cult over. Wait, where the fuck are we going? Oh, right. Central, Dr. Grimm has spotted. Moving to intercept. Oh, and then we're just gonna be like fucking ear ravenly loud with the dialogue. Yeah, jeez. Oh, weapon part. Oh, full auto slide for the pistol. All right. 
right. Wait, they don't know I'm here? Oh shit, I should just grab the first guy. Fuck you, don't roundhouse me. Oh yeah, what is happening? Is it time for a scary mind ghost now? The fuck? Yo, what the fuck happened to this library? Oh, damn it. Yeah, here's where I would put a secret. But you can't get up there, damn it. Oh well. Objective. The fuck is that? Fuck is this? Oh shit! Okay, choose a burst fire of explosions. Apparently, that's pretty metal. I didn't think it would. Okay, nice. There's extra ammo. Yeah, I didn't think it would shoot that entire fucking burst all at once, but uh. Gotcha, boss. Funny thing is that I don't find anyone to shoot at. Oh yeah, that's definitely not. Yeah, that's just a waste of ammo. I wonder if I can shoot down the helicopter. Ah, uh, the helicopter is invulnerable, isn't it? Yeah, it seems so. Unfortunately. Well. Shit, they're just fucking black piles. Take care. Yeah, what the fuck is this? Oh, the grenade launcher. I don't feel like I need it right now. Yeah, it's it's not just that the audio levels are like weirdly normalized. Like even different audio elements are not like properly normalized either. Like the dialogue right there, like. The uh, enemy, like, call out or whatever, it's like way, way louder than like your teammates. I hope they really do fix it. Because it just fucking hurts my ears. Like, I turned down the volume. Like, I, I, I turned down your, your guys' volume for, um,. For the stream, so it's even worse in my ears. Like the audio was peaking all over the place, according to Wavelink until I turned down. So like, I guess I'm listening to peaking audio now. 
Could it be automized? I had no idea. There's gonna be one, some way to fix it. I mean, I know there is. Other games typically don't have issues like these. Again, it's like, it, it's a case where the audio designs, or rather the lack thereof, like just affects the entire game experience because it's just so jarring when the audio levels are all over the place. And like, I understand that some things should be louder than other things and some things should be more quiet than other things, but not like this. We are not proud of our collaboration with the Horizon Corporation. However, the sacrilege technology shall aid us in our quest for knowledge and power. We have already converted some of their staff to our cause, and their CEO, a young and ambitious man, reminds us of our patriarch in his prime. Together, we shall unlock secrets and ascend to glory. What our weapon part? Hey, chew X scope for whatever weapon this is. But all in all, like it, uh, it's not like this game is a sixty or seventy buck game. Like it costs thirty bucks, and it's fairly new. I'm sure if they can just get like a patch or two out, then that fixes the audio, then like everything will be a okay. And I hope for their sake that they really do it because it's like. It's just so jarring. A very fun game being boggled down by this. Incendiary for shotgun? Oh hell yeah. Oh hell to the fuck yeah. Unfolded incendiary. Projectiles explode and set enemies on fire but less damage and less accurate. Hey, you know what? I gotta try it, man. Bolt mode. Oh, this must be the bolt for explosive and penetrator. Fires a free run burst of bolts. Explode, explode two seconds after impact. Two x zoom. You know what? I could take a scope for that. Why not? That seems very silly to do so, but let's do it. Oh, boss arena. He didn't make it sad. What's with the fucking post mannequins? I don't like it. Looks like all of Spectre 3 is KIA. Yep. This guy's just hanging to the wall. Damn. Yay, okay, more intel. Oh, throwing ice? Hell yeah. Dr. Kramer log two. I'm beginning to feel skeptical about the cult experiments. It's clear that their methods are dangerous and unsound. I have yet to see any real progress. Perhaps they weren't entirely honest with their promises. I mean, it's a fucking cult, dude. And it's like, what the fuck do you expect? Cocos and cream and berries on top? It's almost like most cultists base their entire foundation on lies or something. Oh, still gotta find his helmet. Oh, it's probably that pinging noise, actually. Gotta be above. I 
Ah. Body's missing. He could still be alive. Check the helmet cam. It's heavily corrupted. I'll try to stream some of it. Uh oh. The music is amazing, by the way. Like a good mix between like metal and drum and bass. I love it. Oh, now that's a gun. I gotta hit the throwing knife. I gotta hit the gritty. Oh, for fuck's sake, the pole! Oh, that's amazing. Oh, he didn't die? Oh god, fire grenades. The throwing knife sucked, they don't kill. Who just wants to set the world on fire, I see. Of course. The flesh golem? That doesn't sound good. I don't think that's Spectre Free Actual. Also, I was not a big fan of the incendiary. I want the choke, though. Oh, intel. Enforce a log to you. Okay, I love this aesthetic. Fucking... That's cool. We train here to perfect the art of raiding the house of the non-believers. We will take what rightful belongs to us and use it to build our empire. Remember, the non-believers are weak and deserve to be punished for their ignorance. That doesn't sound like a nice cult. I mean, Pyro, we're killing cultists. That's that's gotta be that's gotta be like atonement enough for my fire setting shenanigans. I don't know where I was going with that. All right. Yeah, that, that's that. Okay, yeah, it's like the same gun I have, but without the shooting scope. I see. That's what that is. Wait, armor. I just there any more health in here? Yeah, there is good. And jump scare in three, two. Oh shit! Oh. Okay. I got fucking kicked in the dick. Oh my god, I get I fucking blow myself up. Oh what the fuck was that? Did you guys see that? He just grew out something flashy from his arm. 
Yeah, be careful with this weapon, I see. How is he not dead yet? Whoa. Oh no! He fucking pulled me in. Sure, there's gotta be a weak spot. Oh, maybe he has a weak spot on his back. Oh my god. I gotta try shooting him in the back because it's like obviously his front doesn't seem to really care. But he seems to have like a bunch of like smaller dudes on his back. Like where the extra heads and stuff are sticking out of. Wait, can you see me? Oh shit, yeah, you got me. God damn it, I keep blowing myself up with that fucking weapon. You're a funny guy. No! Oh, that's enough. Okay. Now we know what the scientists were doing here. Building another super soldier. Nothing else we can do here. Final task is neutralizing the Patriarch. All right, director. Wait, we don't just go out through what? Okay. Yeah, this bolt launch is pretty cool, but. I think I would have preferred the uh, other ammo type for it, but we had to unlock it, so... Like, th this is explosive, the other one is just penetrator, apparently. Oh, shit. Oh! So it's true. You really are just like me. The question is... Are you any better? Oh, shit, this guy is fucking Dio Brown, though. Well, there's Spectre Squad. Director, Patriarch sighted at the courtyard. We're moving to intercept. Negative. Hold fire, Spectre. Dual wield serum. Huh. All right. Sure, why not? Find another weapon of the same type. We'll shoot at the same time. Huh. <laughs> oh, are you fucking kidding me? That's so cool. Wait, we, we can just do a wield any gun now as long as we find two of them? 
Man, that's so fucking Terminator 2, it's amazing. And you know that we can't do dual wielding without doing the double pistols, man. <laughs> Look at the fucking draw animations for a pistol, I love that. Ah, oh, that's so cool. Hmm. When dual wheeling, I almost feel like it makes more sense to do like folded stocks, right? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh my god, the slides are fucking golden. Oh, look at how reflective they are. Full auto golden pistols. Let's go. We got this shit. The Patriarch's escaping! <laughs> Alright boys, we can kick some ass. Oh my god, that's just badass! <laughs> The fact that you can dual wield anything is just fucking amazing. Shame that you can't like cross dual wield like in Halo 2, but... Fuck it, I'll take it. Like, you get less accuracy, but like, the fucking firepower. I haven't even tried to pistol yet. This is our only chance. 106, you need to get to that monument before the next wave shows up. Take the underground. Find and kill the patriarch. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, let's try this. Yeah, we're gonna kill a fucking patriarch with full automatic fire from both fucking weapon sets. Well... No, I can save them. They're here. Oh no, Ward has got no head. Let's fucking go after him. Oh, there's the penetrator. Oh, shit. 
fuck, I kind of want to try that out, but do a wielding vectors though. Let's just see what it's like. More accurate than powerful non non explosive bolts, single fire. I bet that you will stick people to walls when you fucking shoot them with them. Yeah, they're like the fucking spike gun in fear. Oh, but I want to try these too. Fuck, we'll do dual wield pistols and the penetrator. Fuck it. Dual wield vectors can come later. Oh, that's some recoil. Oh wow, we're almost out of pistol ammo just like that. Oh yeah. Nice. There's no way, yeah, you can't deal wield that one. That would be too fucking weird. Or too fucking good, rather. But also very weird. Oh, yeah, I dig the penetrator much more of the explosives. Okay, that's one vector. Let's just find vectors. Luckily, this cult is into louder fucking vectors. Here we go, long barrel full of stock. Let's go. Oh, okay, that's actually more effective than the dual wield pistols. And we're out of ammo. Oh my god, out of ammo again. Just the leading bad guys, yeah. Okay, let's do a wheel normal pistols. Maybe that's more controllable. Oh yeah, that is more controllable. That feels really good. Nice, got him. I like the shanting in this music. Yeah, he's trying to find as much ammo as possible. I'm a bit sad that the penetrator around doesn't actually like send them flying and pinning them to the walls and stuff like that. Like the needle gun and fear did that. And you know, their fucking crossbow and half-life does that. So I'm a little bit disappointed that it doesn't just send people flying and like sticking them around, but Yeah. Over here. Let's do some skeet shooting, shall we? Oh, does that pin into the wall? No. I saw the trip bars, I was like, oh, hold on one second, and they fucking shot it. Damn. That's some good AI.
yeah, do a wheel and pistols with slow motion. That's the way to go. Oh, I think that might have hit multiple enemies. Oh, wish you can find more pistol ammo. Yeah, like dual wheel and pistols, like that's it, it. Like, not only is it badass, but they're actually very effective too. Dual wielded, so much fun. This entire game is just so much fun. I really enjoy it. Oh shit. Hello, motherfucker. Today is a day of grieving. You are the second brother I must kill. Okay, Pedro, boss fight music. Oh, come on, don't tell me I can't see something like this. That would be, uh... Oh shit, he teleported. Okay, something new is happening. That guy's head liquid. Uh, I think it was. I think it's a bunch of teeth for, for some reason. Apparently, this cultist slice off their faces for some reason and then wear the mask over them. Which, you know, if you didn't slice up your face in the first place, you wouldn't have the problem. But that's just my suggestion. If you mean the rest of the head, it's just a bunch of golden masks around in a circle. Like a multiple mass. Where's the fun in that? Exactly. Oh! Okay. All the fucking ads instantly melted me. Oh, he's on his last bar of health still. Good. Oh, basically exactly where I died. Oh my god. Yeah, they just toss grenades and everything when I get in here Oh my god, they're just fucking suicide firebombing everything ah! Oh, he turned into a fucking demon now? Oh, where was that other shotgun at? Yeah, baby! Okay, I'm not sure how I'll destroy him because it doesn't seem to take damage from normal fire anymore! Yeah, he doesn't give a shit. Oh, wait, that, that's not the patriarch. That's just... Another guy, this is the Patriarch. So we just gotta avoid that, that guy while we fight the Patriarch. Oh boy, oh boy. Woo! Oh, so hello, Raptor. Oh, 
Fuck. Wait, he accidentally grabbed the pay charge. Low. I guess we get to see his face now. Break the cycle. Oh yeah, I totally get what you mean now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It actually did look like liquid. All right. We managed to cast a vexel survivor, some specters one and two. What a fucking mission, sir. That was a bit of an, a rough mission and, and, but, you know, whatever. Not much time left for morning, huh? Yeah, you get used to it. You shouldn't. But you do. We need to go on the offensive again. Agreed, Core Master. Agreed. By speaking of... I want new dual wielded pistols. I keep forgetting where the fuck the firing range is every time. There it is. Yeah, so that's a bolt launcher. That's a new weapon we just got. Cool. We unlock a minigun if we also complete Iron Dragon Data Center. So I'm going to keep my eye open for that mission. I think we can do it already. Nope. Nice. Yeah, gonna keep the bolt launch and the pistol like that. Just seems to be a good combo. Frag grenades. Yeah, let's try dual wielded silence pistols for some reason. That that actually doesn't seem like it would be very effective at all, because it's like, how, how am I supposed to be like accurate with this? But. Then again, I wonder if the bolt launcher is silent. Ooh. Oh, it does over penetrate. Hmm. Or does it? No, it definitely did that one time. Oh, there it got stuck in the fucking... Oh, shit, we can see the exact model, how this looks like. That's cool. Wonder what all the designations mean. That's one giant-ass bolt. Yeah, it does penetrate. It's just that you gotta, like, shoot high up enough because the fucking spinal cord or whatever apparently catches the bolt. That's funny. Oh, that just turned him into mins. I wonder if it's just better to aim for the chest then. I don't know. Uh -huh. Actually, let's... Yeah, yeah, refresh that and we'll test the accuracy. Okay, you know what? The accuracy isn't bad at all with the wheel of pistols. Except we're trying to go for leg shots, I guess. God, such a badass animation. All right. Oh, no, it's back here. Having a lot more combat simulator missions. We might do these at another time. Oh yeah, there is plenty of like missions here. Whoa, that's cool. 
just a bunch of uh, like wave survival missions essentially we might do this at another time uh, right now I want to focus on the campaign and the side missions To the hell yeah right so we got another side mission okay we got three four five side missions six wait no one two three four five. yeah six and one main mission well we'll do iron dragon data center because that unlocks a minigun for us iron dragon data center is a highly secure facility housing thousands of servers for Earth horizons operations in the pacific Break in and retrieve confidential data from their servers. Horizon has been increasing their security spending. It's time we hit their infrastructure so we can disrupt their logistics. Hey, good luck out there. Thanks, Quartermaster. Love you. I just remember one thing. I forgot my GBO2 dailies. That's free tokens I'll never get back. And a login bonus. Welcome aboard, sir. Just sudden realization that I fucking missed my daily today. God damn it. I guess this game's good. I love FOMO mechanics. Yeah. I mean, in my case, it's like, it's a good re- Wait. Why is one of my pistols suppressed, but the other isn't? Okay, it, it has the sound of a suppressor, it just doesn't show. That's funny. For me, it's for me, it's a good reason to just log in and play like an hour of the game every day. So I don't mind it too much, but kind of sucks because I'm working to get those tokens so I can do like a, another gotcha roll before the banner resets. But yeah, just having to say these words at all, like yeah, <laughs> there's, there's there's bullshit in that game. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Very enjoyable game, but bullshit still. Sir, we got a situation here. We've got an intruder in the server room. What the hell are we paying you jackoffs for? Go check it out! Angry military man. God, I feel so bad as with dual wielding pistols. He did call me a fucking pussy because I took a hostage. Yeah, the, the combat shatter is great in this game. Oh shit, deep base. Yo, we're doing fucking hip hop beats now? No? There's the drums. And a guitar. Yeah! 
<laughs> Drop kick him. Oh no, my hostage died. <laughs> Oh shit, he is fucking pumped. As I grab him. Wait, ass fart? What would the other fart be? Lurking, much appreciated, man. Did he rip an ass fart quote of the year right there? Yo, that my cry? <laughs> I heard grenade out and I slide right into it. Oh, nice checkpoint right there. See, playing on very hard isn't that frustrating because there's constant checkpoints. Oh my god, please. Whoop. Yo, where's my music at? Aww. Oh, that must have hit multiple people. Oh, I think it took off triple. It was a triple kill. Holy shit. I think there was three guys in there. I took all, all, all of them with a single penetrator round. Awesome. Uh, where's the music at? Did it bug out because I died? Oh, I missed both of them. Okay, there we go, museum. Thank you. Oh, that did not penetrate. Oh. Nice! Oh, it didn't kill all of them. Oh, shit. my ass literally thought that I got the first guy and then when I when he didn't I just I had to finish him off you know
Oh, I missed. That again? Jesus. Oh, no grenades, right? Okay, I got the best hostage in the world. Yeah, when you like just get into the fucking zone, this game is just awesome, dude. up here suppressor for the minigun what oh my god my aim Where's the next server at? Oh, it's actually upstairs. I didn't know I had flown up to it. Damn it. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Use the enemy to get get up there again. Nice. I knew getting good at that would amount to something. Okay, we need a new uh, weapon instead of the bolt launcher. Let's see. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Okay, that worked out. <laughs> Get some of your own size, asshole. Nice. Oh, shit, Juggernaut. Oh, that's him. He said that. More like dead. Oh wait, don't grenade myself, that's a bad idea. Yeah, it's fucking smack him. This game, game kind of reminds me of Shattered Steel also. Which I didn't play more than the campaign, but I've heard they got a roguelike mode in that. I'll just check it out again sometime. Shattered Steel is awesome. That landing game that lets me have fucking slow motion and dual wielded awesome guns. It's a good game in my book.
God, this fucking wall every time, man. I missed that. No, I had to redo the entire hack. Oh, fuck. Oh, they're fucking martial arts. Raptor, when are you gonna play a bit battle with us? Well, the thing is, I bought Raptor Battle Bit, but his microphone isn't working in the game. And he's done like all the fixes and he can't get it to work. On like a new machine as well. And since he can't use the proximity shot, which is like the one thing he did. What the fuck is happening with the door? It's like the one thing he's, he seems that seems to be fun for him. It's like he's not that interested without it. And the reason I'm speaking for him is because he just said he was lurking, so he's not here. Otherwise, he would play the game with us if he could get his microphone to work. Oh, we got kicked my way up here again. Grab this guy, throw him as a grenade. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. There's some grenades finally. Oh yeah, he was not dead. Yeah, oh, I blew myself up. Shit. Tough wave, tough wave. I remember having a thing like that in Fastman having to go into Windows and set my default. I'm like, yeah, we, we, we tried fiddling around with that as well, but no luck. Like a bunch of people had suggested that too for uh, Battle Bit. Alright, mines. There's the shotgun. There we go. A shotgun with very little ammo. Sometimes the kick kills them, sometimes it doesn't, so I just double tap them to make sure. Actually, no, 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 give me him. 
God, I wish I had fucking spaz on. I guess I had to pick up a vector. Oh, that's an assault rifle. Here's a vector. And there was another vector. Do a wheel, motherfucker. Okay, no, we're good. Fuck a rifle it is, not finding any vector ammo. Oh my god, the wave ended. Right, we can buy ammo here. I almost forgot that this was a thing. Well, I did forget this <gasps> Fuck, wrong button. I did forget that this was a thing. There we go. Health kit, frag, armor. Pistol ammo. We don't need a task force to help us out. We got this. Now that we got the spas, we got this. Oh, so those grenades explode on impact, but the grenade launcher grenades doesn't? Oh no! It was a fucking juggernaut, damn it. Fuck that dude in uh no, it's out to say with the wave end. Okay, thank god. If I had to do all that all over again, I don't know what I would do. I'd probably do it all over again and cry about it, but you know. Oh yeah, you can buy extra supplies and had them lying there. I wonder how that happens if you like kill another wave when you're supposed to extract. Let's finish up this wave and see what happens. Be, be kind of boring. I kind of hope you get another re reward for it. That would be fun. Oh, I'm about to find out. <laughs> no, damn it. Oh. Yeah, those juggernauts, man. Let's just get the bolt launcher. Oh yeah, we can modify our weapons here, good. Yeah, I want the penetrator rounds. There we go. Right, that's the Juggernaut.
Damn it! What the fuck? Oh, so many disruptors just constantly like fucking up the hack, so we didn't really like progress anymore despite all the slaughtering. Oh yeah. Actually, yeah, we have to stay for a while because uh Whitman's a high value target and I think he'll spawn at the end of the wave that's on or that's going on. Again, I have no idea what eliminating all the high value targets do, but knowing that they're a thing you can miss, I wanna try to get him. So yeah, we have to stay until Whitman's dead. God damn it, another Juggernaut and I'm fucking stuck! <laughs> damn it, it's just going worse and worse. Shit. Right, I didn't resupply this time, that's the issue. Okay, let's just do a bolt launcher. And instead of dual wielding pistols, we'll do a wield SMGs. We'll do, uh... Oh my god, run button, fast me. I bought two SMGs, where, where did the other one go? Shit, I accidentally detonated it. I can't afford another one. Oh my god, annoying. There you go, just take up another vector from the enemy, that works. Where am I to play box go? No! Oh, there it is. Nope. Yeah, Vectors just melt Juggernauts. Oh shit, no! Oh, that's awkward. I forgot that the bolt launchers on like explosive. If you don't modify it. Fuck. Yeah, and when it's explosive it shoots an entire burst. I accidentally buy a rifle. Fuck. Push one back. Affirmative. Shit, penetrator, and then these. Oh, I can't put long barrel on him. Well, make do with what we got. Oh, yeah, when you're interfering, it actually reverses your hack, too, I just noticed. Oh my god, no. Oh my god, don't die! Fuck! 
But yeah, we gotta survive until Whitaker, whatever his name was, appears. Fuck! Oh, damn. Uh. It's fucking hard, dude. How about this? We try to do a winning rifles instead. I didn't get RNG like this where it's like the hack just completes anyway without issue. There we go, you just gotta use the bolt launchers against the Juggernauts and they're not a problem. Now do a willing rifle, that's a bad idea. Sometimes just because you can doesn't mean you should. Hey, watch out. Move. Yeah, nail the backpack on him with the bolt launcher. Mr. Whitaker, where are you? Go play for that, bastard. Get him killed, Fire shit. No, 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 there's another one, there's another one, there's another one, there's another one, there's another one. There's another one. Okay, we got armor, we got armor, we got armor. We're oh, still good. Fuck! Oh, and I don't identify the Juggernaut, and there's two of them, and there's fucking. Oh, crap. Oh, that doesn't c kill him. There we go. Yeah, I gotta kill 26 enemies just like this. Okay, that killed him really quickly. Let's go save all the ammo. Save all the ammo. Yeah, that's good, that's good.
13 enemies left. Come on. Nope, that's a you're not. Think that killed him? Yep. me instantly oh dude I'm not leaving without fucking Whitman dead I don't care how much we fucking take out of me we're gonna fucking do this shadow okay I need your fucking encouragement send me your energy I think I just shot that grenade. I know that two of them are like juggernauts. to save and now Whitman's gonna pop out I think if it doesn't pop out now I'm like I'm 100% sure that he, he's gonna like come out in one way or another right, there's gotta be a reason for staying past the like the extraction window right and obviously he's still in the building so he hasn't like escaped oh boy but that's okay. I, I, we got an auto save for that wave, so I, I could afford to be uh, a bit messed in there. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna yeah land that grenade. Oh my god Jesus Christ, we're sloppy It's like I finally beat that way. So I'm like, oh shit now. I can like take a break, right? No, I can't Yeah 
Oh, okay, that works too. Not what I had in mind, but... And we miss a lot. We miss a lot. That's not good. Oh, God. I need to have slow motion so I can just unload into these juggernaut nods heads, but I also need uh, slow motion to get them to survive. Fuck. It's hard, man. Killing Whitman is hard. If a tap fire rifle, it's a lot more efficient too. I should keep that in mind. There's a Yorgonaut. My gun didn't reload. It's funny that I'm starting to recognize if a Gargonaut has spawned based on the fucking accent of the enemy, though. Cause like they, they they talk with a much deeper like sudden almost accident and I just kill myself because I distracted myself. You tell me to hydrate? Is is that code name for hydrate? You think I need some water? Oh my god, it didn't spawn this door this time. Hydro homing. Oh my god, that's a- Oh my god, that's a juggernaut. Oh! Yeah, I should get a hydro homing. Wrong button. Oh, you don't even need to have the fucking bolt launch for that, actually. Just spraying him in the head with the rifle works. Ah! 
Which then makes me wonder, should I go for a more explosive bolt launcher in that case? Okay, I know you're going to spawn. Oh my god, and there he was. I wonder where that jugger is. I got him. Yeah, let's do explosive mode, the triple burst. Yeah, it's getting matter of matter. Come on, Whitman. Fucking come out here. Aim before you sponsored like wave 10. Oh, God. No throwables. At least we get a fucking checkpoint for every single wave. Also, I will take a sip of water if I actually had any water on hand, but is Pepsi okay? Them to kill the Arnold, right actually. Oh, we're completely out of ammo, guys. Fucking intense, I ain't got shit on me. I'm literally living magazine to magazine right now. Okay, he had some ammo. No, 
know he's coming in. There we go. That's what I've been waiting for. As soon as he's dead, we can fuck off. Really? He's walking in without any body armor? All right. Easy. Bye. Nice. That's what we were waiting for. HVT Terminator. Terminated. Terminator. Day's work. Yeah, I gotta use the bathroom, but I'll be uh, getting some water. But I also want to see. Oh yeah, here's the uh, HVT list, right? So we just killed. Who did we just kill? Yeah, this guy. Hmm. Oh, this guy only spawns an extreme. That's cool. So for some enemies, you have to play at the very, very, very highest difficulty mode to reach. That's cool. Anyway, I'm going to use the bathroom, get some water. I'll be right back. Also, shears. Our stream. Ooh.
Uh, 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 uh. Whew. All right. Yeah, oil rig. I, I wonder. No, we got an air one we could have gotten so far. Well, except for the except for Rama, but I'm gonna assume that you can go back and play side missions again on a higher difficulty. So, kind of want to know what happens if you collect all of them because that's kind of cool. Anyway. Crash site. Kellington Collar. Collar. Colliery. Yeah, you know, fuck it. Let's do. Let's do one more main mission in Siberia, Russia. Apparently, site eight three, and then we'll uh, call it for today. Horizon repurposed this former Soviet military base into a research facility. Nearby civilians were evacuated early today under cover of a gas leak. We're sending you with a small team to investigate. Copy that, 106. Hilo is ready to go. Before we do that... Be prepared for anything, 106. Yeah, we unlocked the minigun. I want the minigun and I want double pistols again because that's just badass. Yeah, I don't think we're going to do this quietly. Although we can put a suppressor on the minigun, sure. How does that even work? Oh yeah, it just extends four more barrels or whatever. Yeah, let's do a suppressed minigun, why not? Man of the gun, oh, mega the fun. Good luck out there. You know what? You know, maybe maybe we should do suppressors on the pistols too. You know. Actually, we'll just bring one suppressed pistol. Just in case we actually get the opportunity to sneak and start a mission. And if not, then we'll just pick up another one off the floor because I'm sure there's there's plenty of them. Oh. Oh wait, the airlock. You know what? You kind of remind me of the last guy I flew. Ah, uh, never mind. Forget I said anything. I Sus. Oh shit! We got a gas mask on. Limit your movement speed and stamina. Catnip, fuss, scalp, stalker. Director, we located the elevator. Looks like it's still operational. 106, you're the first one in. Phantom 1314, back him up. Copy that. That's not one free, that's one one. Signal's getting spotty down there. Remember to recon the area and report. Reception's fucked. Looks like we're on our own here. Yeah. Maybe we can talk to professionalism for us. Uh oh. Stop for a moment there. Unauthorized personnel detected in the loading bay. Alerting security now. Well, so much for stealth. Shit, we got heat. Reach the bottom floor. 
Anyone still receiving? Dead air. Hmm. The gate's automatic. We need to find a switch or something. Uh, I can do that. Room, the one right next to me. I'm a good boy. I'm a good subject boy. Gas mask protocol. All personnel must own gas masks and CBRN suits immediately. Shelter in place and will await further orders. If you experience auditory or visual hallucinations, disarm yourself and report security immediately. Is this where the game goes fear and gets spooky? Logistics report. I'm writing the, the uh, I'm writing this report to document the strange occurrences happening in our logistics department. Despite rigorous checks several times along the way, items are going missing. We have ruled out theft that sometimes unaccounted for items show up elsewhere or we find duplicates somewhere along the way. One thing that annoys me with the mini is that you can't just rev it up or like keep it spinning. Paging HR. 176 job positions are now vacant. Uh oh. This whole facility is running on low power, but the damn PR system won't shut the hell up. Cut the chatter. Be like 106. Uh oh. Uh oh. Spaghettios. It's okay. Nothing can scare me because I have a minigun. Hold on. What's over here? Armor. Then scare me, I promise. Mm -mm. Didn't even flinch. History log. Site 83 was a formerly was formerly a Soviet military base. It was built sometime during the 1970s. For unknown reasons, it was abandoned and sealed up by Soviet government after an incident in 1986. Decades passed and was all forgotten. However, thanks to connection with CEO Anton Lazar, in 2035 the facility has been reopened and is now being started by Horizon. Damn, that picture though. automated to 106 see if you can find a generator we'll keep this hallway secure all right yeah i can keep it spinning if i'm a smart Uh-oh. For safety reasons, running is discouraged. That's uh, 600 kilometers an hour. That's uh, pretty fast. I'm going to scoff at. Since the electrical incident, more obvious have been reported missing. Additionally, one member of the security was unaccounted for. And we are unable to locate him or his signal. We're conducting a thorough search of the facility.
Uh oh. Okay. Looks like the door is powered on. Get back here. Well. Can go through there. Oh, vent. I bet there's a hidden weapon part in here. Uh oh. Spoopy. It's all good. Wait. Oh, scientist log one. The crystal, Soviet 83, was unintentionally electrified during a power surge. The power blew out entirely and vibrations were felt all across, all across the facility. The crystal started to grow brighter. We, we will attempt to shock it again under more controlled circumstances. I'm confident our containment procedures are adequate. Spoilers, they were not adequate. Oh. Significant increase in recent workplace oh. accidents. 32 injuries, 74 deaths, 102 uncategorized. History log 2. The Soviets discovered a mysterious crystal which the which the designated object 83. The discovery was met with excitement but soon turned to horror as staff began disappearing or going insane. It was believed that the strange occurrences were caused by breathing in chemicals emitted by the crystal. A filtration system was installed and all staff, all staff were required to wear a gas mask. With these precautions in place, work resumed until an undocumented incident in 1986 resulted in a rushed evacuation. Before most personnel could escape, the entrances were sealed with concrete, and many personnel were trapped and never found. That's Soviets for you. Ooh, there's a lot of marinara on the walls. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh fuck off. I'm fucking full screen jump scare. Fuck you, game. That's assy. I don't enjoy that. <laughs> Don't run. Can't kill then. All right, we enter the spoop of this game now. They're blind. Okay, that's actually pretty fucking spooky. Today we witnessed the crystal physically pulling and absorbing several objects within close proximity of it. We are unsure where they are taken to. We placed several cameras inside and they continue to transmit from location at least thousands of miles away. Judging by signal speed... Oh, judging by signal speed, damn. We are coordinating with security to send a team to explore the area and locate the missing guard. Well... Oh no. It's really just a fucking jump scare cloud. Oh, there's a weapon part in there. 
You know what? I gotta go for it. Pinging, Doctor Romanov. Location: Sublevel B19. Oh, there's a burst pistol. Is this where we run anyway? Oh, another weapon part. Oh, a suppressor for uh, assault rifle? We fired an electrical current at the crystal. This time nobody went missing, but we heard voices that we couldn't explain. Strangely, none of the recording equipment was able to capture it. In surveillance room, we noticed that the missing security guard's handle camera was not switched on. It was on the floor in a yellow fluorescent room. Definitely not... Wait. It was on the floor in a yellow fluorescent room. Definitely not a known part of this facility. Somehow the location looked familiar to all of us, though. We could recognize some of the log missing objects in the room. We try to locate him, but the camera's coordinates are out of range. The latitude and longitude put him somewhere off of the Gulf of Guinea. Or Guinea. Must be a problem with the signal. Yellow fluorescent room that just makes me think of, you know, the back rooms. So this is just an SCP that transports you to back rooms or to the back rooms or what? Auto saving. Oh boy, I have a to the loading bin was activated somehow. What? Oh, fuck. That's not good. And he gets worse. The PA system said there is some unauthorized activity in the loading bay. Think we ought to check it out. Shit. Think we got infiltrated. Or, uh, I don't know, maybe the rescue team. No, 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 no. Never mind, no. He's just trying to play tricks on us. We gotta stay focused, stay with the team. It's just trying to separate us. Not gonna happen. Oh, they just turned around. Damn it. Yeah, yellow fluorescent light rooms, fucking hazmat unit people. Like, yeah, this is definitely backroom shit. Fucking Christ. Which is funny because if you think about it, we're like kind of like an SCP in the equal. <laughs> With the shit that we can do. Well, shit. Is it really so wise? You know? To like go running and gunning when this fucking thing is in the facility with us?
Medical officer's note. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, we're definitely going into spooky territory. There's been a recent significant increase in patients ending up in the infirmary. The majority of these cases involve accidents with heavy machinery. It, seems, it appears that individuals experience hallucinations or blocking out while operating the equipment. All right. Not really sure where to go. Oh, wait, for here? No. Oh, yeah, I guess for here. Attention. Facility is at over capacity. Food rations not sufficient. Expedition report two. Teams were split up in Alpha, Bro, and Charlotte to cover more ground once. Suddenly, Bro and team emitted a loud static from the mic and went radio silent. Alpha and Charlotte moved to the location but only found the mutilated remains. The surviving expedition team members requested the EWAC, but we still don't know their location. We ordered them to proceed with the search. Okay, there's some bullshit going on in there. I am not fucking stepping in there. The security team is growing increasingly anxious about a missing guard, and the scientists are curious as to what is happening inside. We are sending a team of 20 for best security personnel, all equipped with cameras and 10 days of supplies, to approach the crystals and try to locate the missing guard. The expedition team approached the crystal, and one by one they were sucked in. Upon arrival, they found themselves in an area consisting entirely of yellow plaster walls, carpets, and fluorescent lights. They spent, the team spent the whole day mapping out the area, covering over 30 kilometers, but it looks to be an endless labyrinth. As a commander of security personnel on Site 83, I wish I could join them, but I have my duty servicing a mission from here. I will continue to observe and report from the camera feeds. Yep, it's literally as the back rooms. Why is that room fucked up from here, uh, or from there, but not from the other side? Like, will something bad happen if I go in there? Oh yeah, there's, there's gonna be a scare here, I can fucking- Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, fuck me, no! Oh, no! Oh, fuck no! Oh, bull fucking shit! Man, I don't want to fucking be here. Oh. Fuck, literally any room that you can go into is just a bad idea. Do not enter. And how would you enter? It's literally... Oh my god, no. I don't like this.
Danger, do not enter. Fuck, there's something behind me, fuck. Oh no, this is actually starting to get way too fucking creepy for me, dog. Yeah, those fucked up paintings from before. That was sheep. That was fucking sheep. Fuck off. God, this is... Dude. I'm actually fucking scared as hell right now. Auto saving. Okay, that means that we can die again. Yep, I fucking knew it. Just sprint. Fucking really? <sighs> Backrooms expedition free, yep. It literally went from expedition report to backrooms expedition, yep. With the expedition team suffering losses, Carpet is looking to get involved to run the situation from getting worse. They are assembling a team of specialists to take over. The expedition team reports seeing moved in the shadows and hearing voices. We weren't able to observe either for the camera fees, and we are worried it might may be hallucinating. Well, we're back to the guy that we shouldn't run from, I think. Customizable weapons, eh? Dual wielding pistols. Let's see what the burst light is about. Oh, yes, it becomes the fucking ivory USP. Oh my god, that's sexy. What? Oh, fuck off. <laughs> oh, fuck off.
Holy fucking shit. It, it's amazing how a game like this can make you go from... Oh. It's amazing how this game can go from fucking... You feel like an absolute badass mauling everything and slaughtering everything to... Whatever the fuck this is. Well, the elevator's not working. Fuck, what's that? Well... Oh hell yeah, the burst pistol feels good. Oh boy. Oh, that's just the sound of a rival bugging. I was like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> What the fuck is that actually? It's a fucking like piece of brain or something. <laughs> That's literally my brain doing work order. Oh, that's funny. I'm not really sure what I'm doing right now. Maybe we are supposed to go back down. Oh, it's dropped down from here. Well, for a little spooky backrooms part, they at least gave you two weapon parts for it, but I have a feeling that it's not over yet. Oh, yeah. Oh. It's the game being bullshit. Yep, that's not the real Phantom 2. They're just trying to fucking cook up a scare again. Expedition report for Day 7 suddenly we received loud deafening static from the expedition team members and all camera feeds were cut The gas alarms went off and everyone ran <sighs> Went to get gas masks those who weren't able to put one on in time God helped them We radioed for QRF and sent out a distress call before we could hear any replies, corporate shut off our comms and elevators. Probably afraid we'll contact local authorities because of PR incident. We're all just sheltering a place and hope, hope, hoping someone's coming to get us. Yeah, man. Fuck off. Oh god. Oh god. No! Not more of fucking this! Cover and go! I'm on 
Oh, we're doing fucking combat in the back rooms. All right. Oh, hello, creepy Mona Lisa. Lay back rooms. Yeah, I know. I have a feeling that this is a bullshit scare room. I'm not going in there. I'd rather not take supplies. Yeah, dude, the fucking door. No, 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 no. I'm not going in there. When the fucking back rooms is trying to be kind, you know there's some bullshit. Fuck off. I'm not taking your supplies. Oh, fuck off. Not this shit. <laughs> Roundhouse, the next guy you see? I fucking wish. Wait, I still have this fucking thing. Like, you think the, the back rooms wouldn't be scary if you have a minigun, but trust me. Not even a minigun can prepare for the bullshit that's about to occur. Oh shit. No. Okay, got him. Oh wow, they got too much armor for that to really be effective. Expedition member log. Something seems to be moving in the shadows or just out of our visions. We thought we heard voices in the distance, but as we got closer, it turned out to be recordings of our previous radio transmissions. Yeah, I like that the enemies that we're fighting are actually just, you know, like hazmat, back rooms, you know, personnel. Caution, do not enter. Well. Compensated laser altar. I wonder how this fires. Well, that's kind of cool, but I still prefer my burst pistol. That said, I wouldn't mind, like, an assault rifle instead of the minigun. I don't like how the minigun feels. Dang it, this has no ammo. Fuck it. Oh, that's what happens if you step into the laser wall. Blue sky officer. No, I want to grab him. I want to stab his neck. Oh, I can't. Well, aren't I glad I have a minigun? Let's fuck it. Why is if I toss him against the grate? Nothing. Yeah. I'm just gonna take you with me, and I'm gonna feed you to the SCP monster that's inside of here. Sound good? Wait, where the fuck did I come? Did I come from that staircase back there? Hello, SVP monster. I got an offering for you. Oh. Oh, boy. That's not good. Key to the 
again! We gotta destroy this thing! Again, I like that they replaced Dell with Hell. That's just... I don't know. I like it. Yeah, they got a giant turret down there. I wish you could come down there and help. Oh. Subject A to free 102 containment. Yep, this is literally SCP backrooms. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, I don't need a suppressor for whatever fight's coming up. Subject A to free, great. We had to literally fight an SCP crystal. Yeah, that's clearly not helping. God, that's fucking creepy. Don't tell me that I actually gotta run into those. I think I do. I think I have to run into them. Priority objective? Alright. No, it's, wait, it's downstairs. Oh, don't be dicks, you fuckers. So they clearly don't want you to touch the switches, huh? There's a day where maybe I should throw these into the fucking. Like, what if I throw a uh, hazmat guy into uh, the shadow people? Okay, not much happens. What if I throw him into the crystal? Oh god. Oh god. He fucking punched me. Well, come on, grab him, grab him, grab him. There we go. What if I throw him into crystal? Nothing. Gotcha. It's not like the thing from before. Oh my god, what the fuck? These husband guys don't fuck around, Jesus. Oh, these shadow people literally don't do anything to you. They just block you from walking in.
I close door? Why? Oh, I can't. Oh, yeah, electricity. Huh. Okay, that did something. Nice, I got up. Ah, shadow people blocking me. Yeah, need like a full slow -mo meter if that's gonna work. That's kind of effective. Oh god. Okay, what are we doing fucking now, you fucking demon? Ah, down there. Well, only one breaker left. Oh shit. You know, I kinda wish I had my fucking uh, minigun from before. Oh boy. Damn. I'm getting fucked up. Yeah, I kind of want to get up that up behind a juggernaut, I guess. Oh, yeah, that's not going to work. Oh, grenade launcher. Now that will work. Oh! <laughs> Mr. <Mrs>. Streamer, <laughs> stream is fucking white. Fuck. I deserve that one, don't I? But where the fuck did that grenade launcher go? Oh, here it is. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. No! Fuck! Oh! So, I guess there's some grenades that are sticky and don't detonate the impact, and then there's grenade launchers where the grenades just detonate the impact. And the first grenade launch I had was definitely the sticky, like, later detonating kind. So now I just blow myself up with this. Oh, 
Oh hell yeah, I got the Juggernaut. And his minigun. Get fucked. Okay, where do you want me to go now? Oh yeah, up here? No, it's just torching all the corpses. Yeah, there we go. Let's see, we've been to that one, been to that one. Should be one upstairs. Yeah, here. I didn't get the skeet shoot him, not quite. There you go. <laughs> oh, pick up intel. TF-27 mission log. New priority objective, destroy Soviet 83. We have lost contact with 106 and the other teams. They may be compromised with KIA. According to our intel, destroying 83 will end the anomalous activities taking place in the area. The prototype 300 kilowatt laser should be sufficient to destroy one shot, but you need to connect to the base's power source. Oh, so that, that's what we've been doing, and now we just fire laser? One last trip to the back rooms? What the fuck? Oh, did the entire base just explode? Oh shit. Yeah, it did. Huh. The base saved our lives, I guess, with a teleport. Okay. I mean, yeah, I literally went through back rooms, bro. Horizon doesn't understand. Anomalies aren't meant to be played with. And nice. Of an eye, that whole black side turned into a crater. It's a miracle you didn't disappear along with it. <laughs> Glad to have you back, 106. Glad to be back. Yeah. So Horizon not only is like... They got their own Black Ops PMC, they're a fucking corrupt tech company, they're also the SCP Foundation. Fantastic, that, that's exactly the fucking kind of company we want. <laughs> Did you guys hear a spooky thing? Or did I imagine that? There was a spooky sound effect just now, wasn't there? Am I paranoid? I think I'm being paranoid. Either way, um... Uh, yeah, just checking the weapons. I'm just gonna check, like... We killed another HPT, I think. I'm just gonna check the next mission, and then I think, uh... Oh, we can unlock a bunch of sheets. Oh, unlock spooky mode. We're still trying to find out what caused that crater. But one thing's for sure. As long as Horizon's still active, everyone's in danger. 
Oh, I actually want to do with burst pistols. But yeah, I, I was kind of like end the stream after that mission. I'm just checking like stuff here in the base. Let's see how does um. Let me get another pistol out. Do wheel that shit. How does double burst pistols feel like? Oh, that's good looking. It's sad that it's not like so you can fire both pistols at the same time, but I'm sure this will do some good ass damage. That's going to be fun to test tomorrow. I'm actually surprised that we've been streaming this game for full six hours so far because I saw like this report that the campaign was only two hours long apparently, but I guess that's if you rush the campaign don't don't do any of the side missions. Yeah, one more HPT eliminated. Yeah, side 83. What's the next mission? Oh, it's gonna be Horizon HQ. Oh, lean on salt and Horizon HQ, destroy Horizon once and for all. Yeah, so okay, so I guess if you actually do just rush the main campaign missions the game is only two hours long because like there's not been that many main missions there's been one two three four yeah there's five main missions apparently but there's a bunch of side missions and stuff um oh crash site in algeria damn um we'll, we'll do the rest of the side missions and the rest of the campaign tomorrow uh because yeah it's just wednesday this was a bonus stream day uh so i'll stream more of this tomorrow at 7 p.m central european time and uh yeah that's that's it for today uh as usual um subscribe on youtube if you guys haven't already follow me on kick if you guys haven't already that shit helps me out a lot uh trepang's pretty fucking fun um Audio, audio issues aside, this is a really, really, really fun game. So, can't wait to see you guys tomorrow and finish this bad boy up. But uh, until then, have a good uh, rest of your Wednesday and uh, see you guys next time. Bye! Target of operation cleared. System switched to normal mode.